on guys and good evening to you all and welcome on in happy saturday evening how's everyone doing i hope you're all having a badass weekend uh, so far and uh, yeah thank you for taking the time to come and join us um over with uh with resident evil containment which is um a fan-made mod made by the very talented modder aiden watkins a uh, good friend of myself and uh you know, everyone else in the RE community is very well known for uh, his mods. Uh, we played a few before previously on the channel, like his um, Resident Evil 1 Hunter mod, where we can play for the whole campaign as a hunter. Um, obviously with exclusive, like, hunter attacks, things like that. We played that on our um, Halloween stream, otherwise known as Halloween stream. Uh, put my own little spin on that. Um, so yeah, we did play it then, and I think we played it another time not long before then, I believe. Um, he also made Barry's mod as well. Uh, where um, you can play as uh, Barry, um, play through the campaign of RE1 um, as our Baz, and uh, also uh, Marvin's mod as well, which we played as a bonus at the end of a stream um, a few streams ago. So it's uh, yeah, it's wicked, man. So basically, Resident Evil Containment, guys. I will let you guys know what it is. It's a new total conversion mod for the original uh, 1996 release of RE1. It follows the story of Ghost, who is a member of the um, USS, the Umbrella Security Service, who was sent into the Arclay Research Facility to investigate a distress call. And the mod pl takes place shortly before the events of Ari Zero and Ari One. So yeah, it's, it's really cool um, that he makes these, um, you know, from a different perspective. You know, he adds new possibilities and uh, things like that in the world of classic Resident Evil, which is incredible. Uh, but yeah, shout out to you guys. Thank you so much for stopping in tonight. We've got Halfway Gamer Dude, we've got Lou's Weird World, uh, Retro Mickey, Dean, Dribs, uh, Amen, Lou Hebe. What's going on, guys? Uh, Amen, are you okay, man? He's, he's saying itchy tasty over in the, the Twitch chat. Uh, don't don't infect the, the Twitch chat, will you, bro? <laughs> you got giving the uh, the Keeper's Diary Room vibes. Um yeah definitely um yeah mickey said this interests me uh, it, it really looks good man um a few um resident evil um channels and friends of ours they've also streamed this um, fairly recently and uh, a little while ago i didn't release this i think uh, back in like late october uh, so yeah i've been be actually meaning to stream this for a while it's been um a bit difficult to um to uh yeah just just fit this in the stream schedule so i was like you know what we'll dedicate saturday night to um re containment what's going on jacko uh dean what's going on man he said decided to sort my ps4 games out what a mess oh no are you like um are you like leon um in ogre 2 what a mess what could have done this <laughs> Cray cray man, uh, are you like alphabetizing them stuff? Are you putting them like in order, like a uh, um, like alphabet or genre? Uh, I'm gonna take it over to the game screen right now, guys. Just gonna be a blank screen just for a second while we uh, just sort out going live everywhere. Cause yeah, we are gonna be jumping uh, straight into this tonight. Let's just um, get us live uh, everywhere. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Get the game screen up. That's wicked, man. That's so good. Right, I'm just going to move this actually over to here. We'll do that. Oh, man. Hang on. Two seconds. It's messed up a game screen up. There we go. Yeah, I'll leave that as it is. I won't tamper with that. I'm just going to leave that there. Awesome. Alrighty, we're looking all good in the hood. All good, man. Alright. Yeah, man, I've still got, like, a lot of, um... I've still got a lot of games to sort out uh, in, in the gaming room. Um, yeah, I've, I've sorted them out for the most part, but I've, obviously I've, I've added more to the collection. Like, there's, there's still way more to add. It's insane. Um, but yeah, thank you guys uh, for stopping on in tonight, uh, for taking the time um stopping for this so with resident evil containment there is actually four episodes um there's four episodes of this and um yeah we're, we're going to play through the prologue i've just got the prologue here i think it's like literally just like 10 minutes long and each episode will be like an hour or so um i think it'll be about four to five hours something around that um to play through all of it um but yeah audio should be all good guys i've tested it all out make sure that's popping it should be fine anyway. <laughs> nice. There we go. Welcome, guys, to Resident Evil Containment. Let's check how we're doing across the board.
Well, yeah, that's the same uh, alarm triggering system in, in OGI 1. That we are all too familiar with. Flying over the Arclay Forest. Nice. Do you remember that view as well? Oh, that's so good, man. Getting a chopper flying across that. That is the view we see uh, in one of the basement rooms. That's so cool. All right, we drop it. We drop it out for the night. Excited, man. Nice. Yeah, so this is the prologue to the series. <gasps> oh. The facility may have been compromised, or even contaminated. If possible, may they give us much intel and briefing. We need to proceed with extreme caution. There's no telling what we might find down there. Nothing I can't handle. Come on, let's get this done. The reassuring voice of Hunk. I love this. So we are playing as uh, the guy uh, in like the, the kind of beige-ish outfit. I do wish we were playing as Hunk, but he's cool though, man. We're playing as Ghost. Uh, welcome on in, guys. Carrie, thank you for dropping those diamonds on in. What's going on, Carrie and Julie? And uh, yeah, say hello um, to Mark as well uh, for me, Carrie. Thank you. Um, but yeah, this is set in the, uh, the world of um, Resident Evil 1. Okay, can't leave yet. Yeah, bro, we just landed. Alrighty. Let's go. Nice. That, that's not too bad, Dean. Like you say, if you're not going alphabetical, it's cool to organise them like, in genre, right? That's really cool. Um, but yeah, alphabetical, I think that is a little um, is a little taxing, isn't it? But yeah, genre, um, organised chaos. I like that. Looking forward to the stream to get me through. Dean, we are here for you, mate. Uh, we are absolutely on hand. Um, just give us a shout if you need anything. We have a super machine gun, so I don't know if that's uh, infinite or not. I'm not too sure. Um, so yeah, I, th I think the audio should be all good across the board, guys. I have cranked it up. Um, I'm going to make some space because it's a little scarce. It's just like playing as Chrissy Redfield over on uh, RE1. Um, yeah, I don't really utilise the knife much. I'll tell you what, I'm, I'm going to take it with us. I'm going to put the first aid spray back for now. So I'm feeling quite optimistic. I'm all G fueled up and everything, you know? <laughs> uh, no worries at all, Becca. We appreciate you being in last night. I uh, said, sorry I flaked. Uh, fell asleep. It was up at 6am. Man, I hope your wake-up wasn't too brutal. And uh, you, you made it. Congrats, you made it through the day. Yeah, have some of you guys been at work this weekend or have you uh, had the weekend off? I am back to uh, duties on Monday. I'm embarking on the, uh, looks like the work course. We disable the power, or shut it shut open. Maybe they were trying to keep us out. Or maybe they were trying to keep something in. Less than the Yeah, maybe they're trying to keep something in and keep it contained. Electronically locked, okay. I need to disable the security system, okay? See, obviously, we are responding to a distress call at this uh, Arclay Research Facility. What's going on, Neil? Welcome on in. And Carla. And, uh, yeah, bless her. You, you're doing the same at the minute, Mickey. Moving the retro game room around. What the hell happened here? It looks like they found the source of the distress call. What could have done this? I'm not sure I want to find out. Check the power. I'll be stuck here. All right. Oh, don't exit out the room. Can we see? Can we see what's... Oh, nice. We need to see. We've got to see uh, all, the, all the blood and gore. What a mess. What could have done this? So we need the, the power room. That's the operating room key. What's going on, Jane? Welcome on in. And Tammy, great to hear from you. Yeah, I'll take it. Obviously, this is Hunk's area. Is he just going to... Oh. 
This is actually the power area in, in, in the OGRE one. What's going on, Matthew? Yes, Matthew. We've got Neil and Jamie and UK Gamers Club. What's going on, man? I am indeed enjoying the night. So this is where we usually turn the power on in RE1. So obviously it makes sense now because th this mod, uh, this is a containment mod, this is called. Um, so this this takes place just before the um, the uh, the events of um, RE0 and RE1. So uh, yeah, real, real interesting. So obviously we're, we're deactivating the power. We've got to shut things down. Here we go. So we've turned it off so we should have access to some areas now. Uh oh. Oh, it's in trouble out there. I can't do anything. Bro's just stopped. Bro's just stopping and listening. Oh, bro. You should have, should have ran sooner. I wanted to run sooner. Hang on, is there anything else around? Yeah, I don't have time to waste here. <laughs> Alright, let's get back to our home. What's going on, Jacko? You having coffee tonight? What's going on, Ash? I'm doing great, thank you, mate. I hope you're well. We've got Big Dog plays video games and Stevie T. What's up, guys? Shit. I've got to pick them out. Bro, using what ammo? We take it out with the. Uh... I'll tell you, tell you what. We'll use these, then we'll go over to the submachine gun. I don't know how much ammo. Um... I don't know how much like ammo we've got um, in the submachine gun. more proper noises these it's usually the, the lab coat zombies in it where they're like <laughs> gotta get close up oh i knew he was gonna get my features is he dead dead or is the blood on the floor camouflage i think he dead dead i think we good whoa 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 okay let's move that all away man there we go Dance with me, bro. Is he dead, dead? I think he dead, dead. He's not got back up. What's going on, Tietzel? Oh, did you get the notification? It's a freaking rude. It doesn't always, does it, man? Most Great to see you in. Researchers at this facility. What the hell was going on in this place? Why weren't we briefed on this? I've got to get out of here and find Hunk. insane to be ordered to eliminate ghosts. Bruh. Just check for like any sort of piss. I don't think there is. It's great to see man. It's great to see like new new like camera angles um on here as well. So need the helipad key. Okay. What's going on Dad Tell us what one in man. Yeah it's great Jane. It's really cool. Yeah we're starting out in the uh the Ackley research facility over in RE1. That's great to hear, Eamon. Um, so can't wait for the Keeper's Diary short film to be released. Me too, man. It is coming early 2024. Um, I was very proud to have um, backed that with, with one of the perks that they offered. Really happy to, uh, 
you know, show my support in that way. Um, one of the guys, uh, one of the four horsemen behind the movie, uh, Andy from Biohazard Declassified, he's currently live right now playing the Ari One director's cut. So feel free to go on and, you know, say, uh, say a, a hey to Andy. Um, he should be across all the major platforms. He is a goat. He is everywhere. He is everywhere. You can't, can't shake him off. <laughs> Alrighty, we're going back down here, I think. What's going on there, Danny? Good evening, bro. Yeah, but all you guys are having a wicked weekend so far. I'm pretty happy it's passed over to Hunk. I freaking love Hunk. We need to do like the um on both um, OG Ari 2 and the remake, we need to do the um the Fort Survivor uh missions, you know, as Hunk and uh, Tofu. I mean I mean the Tofu one Tofu one looks absolutely solid, but um but still. I think uh, it'd be cool to I keep going to reload, but I think whoa 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 almost you almost took a chunk out of Hunk. You ain't taking a chunk out of this hunk. Bro is hunk, but you ain't taking a chunk. I like that, bro. I love the, the, the splattering of the gore. That is so cool, man. Have you seen, like, it looks like, like, bubbling sort of thing. It looks really cool. Um, I can't actually pick up that ink ribbon. It's not, um... It's not letting me pick that up. So I need to find ghosts. So maybe maybe it's not letting you do anything till we till we actually find it, you know. Yeah, still need to find him. Bro, you're giving off some Willy B vibes. Bro looks a lot like Willy B. Lewis, thank you for coming in with that diamond, my friend. Appreciate you massively. Thank you. It's back through here. Yeah, it was like uh, near the power room, wasn't it? I say this little AK is it's good to use, man. I'm a big fan of AKs in games. I always love playing them. Is Ghost not through here? Um, so yeah, Ghost, we're looking for, aren't we? I was in the we went in the save room, didn't we? I think that's when it ended. Go look from in the, uh, in the safe room. What are we all fueled with tonight, guys? What are y'all uh, y'all fueling with? I've got um, I've got the Mega Man um version of uh, G Fuel tonight. I've got the Blue Bomber Slushy. Oh, you're alive. It's one of my favourite flames. Target acquired. What? What do you mean? He's just taken bro out. Insane. Insane bro. So that was just a short prologue. Insane. So yeah, um, we'll head over. Um, I'm just going to do this in a sec. And uh, what was I going to say? And then I will load up episode one. So obviously that, that's just a really short uh, prologue. Uh, each episode should probably be like um, an hour or so long, I think. Um, just give me a sec, so I want to do a little poll over on the tubes. And, uh, there we go. Yeah, thank you guys for um, stopping in with all the likes. If you are enjoying um, the Ari mod so far, if you don't mind dropping a cheek like it helps us uh, massively, thank you. Cool. 
sweet. Okay, uh, let me load up. Let's load up. Uh, I, th I think that is. I think it's literally done. I think it's literally. Don't if there's like anything else at the end of them. But yeah, man, the music hits. I absolutely love the music in the um, in the uh, research facility. So good, man. So yeah, that's been the prologue. Um, I'll just get us um, get us episode one. All right, now it's like a kind of you know proper game, proper game to get stuck into. Awesome. That looks badass, man. <laughs> All right, episode one, guys. Episode one, beyond the depths. That was close. It almost got me. Oh, he never took Thank him out. It was a zombie. Yes. What the? Why? Umbrellas too sophisticated for me. Do they want you eliminated? What? What makes them think I'm an informant? That's exactly what you're going to tell them. Be careful before you hit them. They might be your last words. Do they have something to do with it? No. My sister. She's a researcher at this facility. Hmm. So that's why you insisted on joining me on this mission. When I heard about the distress call from here, I had to do something. I have to find her. I guess Command doesn't want any loose ends in this disaster. That explanation checks out. Hmm. Looks like today's your lucky day. Don't make me look like a bad guy. I just want to find her and get her out of here. She could still be alive. You find her, then you don't disappear. Come on, let's take a look around the lab. Nice. So he actually spared her, I wasn't sure. I totally wasn't sure with it. Uh, yeah, that's good, man. Freaking zombie in the same room, they should be illegal. What's going on, CC and Johnny and Alan? Thanks, uh, guys, for stopping in. It goes a little face in the inventory screen. So cool. The brutal move. What's going on, man? Is that a zero in there? Oh, I think we had unlimited in the prologue, didn't we? I haven't got anything in there. Okay. Might have to keep them with us, I think. Might have to end up resorting to the knife uh, if needed. Let's head out there. See what awaits us. This place is huge. Where should we look first? Let's check the researcher's private quarters. We might find some answers there. That was the operating room, wasn't it? Let's head back. I think it's so cool. Like, it's one thing to bring out a mod, but to actually take the time to make these mods for classic Resident Evil. Come on. I was going to knife. I'm going to leave him. I'll leave him to chill. I think to mod the classic Resident Evil world, I think that's special, man, because they're, they're my okay, favourite games, the OG trilogy. Yeah, they really are special. What's going on, Nat? Welcome on in. Have you got your gaming fuel? I know you said you was getting a load, uh, load of game fuel in tonight. Loads of snacky snacks and stuff for the stream. Let me know what you guys are fueling with. But yeah, I've got the, the blue bomber sushi um, G fuel. It's very nice, man. I've literally almost like ran out of it. I've probably got like a couple, like, a few uh, scoops left. It's a passcode output machine. Don't need to use it. Make sure I'm like actually... Um, checking stuff just in case that there is stuff because things will be changed up on this there'll be obviously different uh, puzzle things to do and 
different objectives and stuff, you know. So I've just done something. Nice. Hidden note. I'm struggling to write this note from the sheer shock of what has happened. There was an accident and the T-virus has been leaked. How the hell did it even happen? The automated security systems were activated and it has sealed many of the other researchers deep inside the lab. It's too late to try and save any of them anyway. Most of them will already be infected and will become the living dead within a few hours. I can't imagine a worse fate, but I suppose we deserve it. Some of the remaining researchers and I are going to escape this lab and make our way to the Spencer Mansion. If we have to die, we don't want it to be in this cold, dark underground tomb. Who knows, maybe we'll actually make it back to the mansion. Then I could enjoy one last drink at the bar while listening to her play that grand piano. Yeah, the, the bar in the freaking, in the Moonlight Sonata room. Let's go. That's so cool. I'd, I, I'd want I'd to go in that room. Or maybe the bar at the, um, at the guardhouse. I, I do love the guardhouse. But then again, while listening to the Moonlight Sonata, nothing else better, bro. Or even um, in like the the guardhouse flooded basement, you you know that that little four like four um, no repetitive loop I like. Do, 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 do. No! Hulk's in trouble. What's going on in there? What's going on, Margarita and Danny? Thank you for stopping, guys. What have you done? He was infected. But he was still human. Maybe, but for how long? He would eventually turn. Better to take care of it now. Maybe we could have saved him. Forget about it. Focus on finding his sister. Did you find anything in the other room? Yeah, I found a note. It said some researchers escaped to the Spencer Mansion. Then that's our next destination. Nice. Go on ahead. I'll catch up to you shortly. I have some unfinished business to take care of. You're a walkie-talkie there. Oh, it's a, it's a key. The helipad key. Okay. We'll take that. Oh, move your, move your biceps. I can't see things to, to check stuff. Definitely nothing in there if we move that. Don't think we can move it, I've just attempted it. Yeah, that massive, that, no, that was like a, a Ben Bernalucci scream, wasn't it? So we can't interact with that. Definitely can't move this, I don't think. No, it's double checking things. Don't end up missing anything. Okay, so we do have the helipad key. That's good. We're going, uh, yeah. Don't want that cell. Head back up here. That's the right way anyway. It's gotta be. Oh. Look, they didn't take chunks out of us. Sounds like Optimum Gaming Fuel, chicken strips, uh, cheesy dip, homemade roasters, and uh, chocolate fudge bites. Nice. With Oreo. Oreo dip. Nice. And Space Raiders. Well, man, I, I love pickled onion Space Raiders. I agree, it has to be pickled onion for sure. Can we lure this guy over here? Save a, a little bit of ammo. Yeah, I don't know how much I'm going to have to ration this stuff, you know. Anyway. 
this always made me laugh this little puzzle in the OGRE one you know this little you, you find the battery literally like there or something then you just have to put it there it was so inconvenient you know yeah. so you could take one less thing but then I kind of I literally pieced it together the last time we played it I was like actually that's so you have a spare slot in it to to be able to um collect the flare then obviously use the flare and then the uh the rocket launcher will drop for you the bazooka which you take me all that time to realize <laughs> man i'm looking forward to going back to the mansion you know so sick go see what's going on in there Oh no, not the caves. Bro, I hate the caves. This place is filled with toxic gas. The filter on my mask won't protect me from it. Oh, we head now. Okay. Look at us ascending. Na 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 na. <laughs> Lee Gamer, thank you for stopping in, Lee. And thanks for dropping a cheeky like. Need to find a way to access your mansion. Yeah, but the route is filled with toxic gas. We'll need to find new filters for our gas mask. There might be some back at the lab. All right, I'll go back and search for them. Here, take this key. It might come in handy. Conference room key, all right. Alright, let's go. Yeah, thank you guys for coming in with the likes. Uh, thanks, Nat, with the share. And, uh, yeah, coming in with the follows. Thanks very much, guys. Okay, conference room. What about some... Um... What's going on, Craig? Thank you for stopping in, my dude. Craig at the Hunk Canavan. Dropping in the stream. <laughs> Keeping on all things zombie. What's going on, man? I hope you're having a great weekend so far, man. Right, let's go take a look. Upstairs where the wall moves. Oh yeah, I think I know where which one. Thank you. All oh, G fueled up tonight. Uh, they've actually brought out a um, a cherry Mega Man flavor. I bet that is epic because this one's real nice. This blue slushy flavor. And yeah, I, I mentioned I'm like down to like the last few scoops on it. Um, and I, I love tray flavoured stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. I forgot we had this guy. We left him roaming, innit? It's a problem, man, when you leave him roaming. Um, nice. Yeah, I think it's called, like, Rush or something. Um, I would like it. I need, to, I need to get that at some point. Nice one, Damien. Sounds good, man. Said, uh, love Resident Evil, just got RE4 Remake for PS5, but as an old school fan, RE2 is the best. Yeah, that's uh, my absolute favourite game of all time, and the original RE2. But yeah, RE4 Remake, it's stunning, man, for um, a modern Resident Evil game, for sure. Absolutely love RE4 Remake. It did look like it, did it, Johnny? A Vauxhall Astrakey. It did look very retro. Engineer's Memo, the facility has been locked down for the last two hours and things are looking bleak. One of the keys for the facility is stored in this room, but the switch has been covered up with a metal panel that's been screwed into place. If I had my tools, I could easily remove the panel and get the key. I was working in the power room during maintenance on the power generators, but when I heard the emergency alert, I ran as fast as I could, leave my tools and supplies behind. The others want me to go back and get my toolbox, but there's no way I'm going back there. Those things are starting to change. They used to be slow and stupid, but somehow they are getting faster and smarter. If they want the key, then they can go and get it themselves. Okay, so there should be a key, like, over in the power room, then. To, um... Yeah. Move it with a screwdriver, so we need to do that. It's covered in blood. I know, man, they're freaking dumb zombies. They, uh... They wrecked the projector. They project the screen. Um... Unfamiliar physics symbols are written here. Okay. Man, I love this this soundtrack. How cool is that? So cool, man. 
side up with this. See the other path a little clearer. Let's have a look. Shots like through here we need to be. Yeah, glad everything's got all good for you, Craig. I've not actually seen those, man. I'm just going to go deposit this. Um, yes, yeah, so let's have a look at the new Dread Ball Z G Fuel flavours. They look ace. You have to take a look at those, man. You can't use this alone. I was gonna like deposit it in the box, but yeah, cause I don't know what's back at the mansion. You know, you know what it's like whenever you go back there. It's like crawling with hella stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. We head back um, from through here. Should be in this next room, I think. Oh shit! Oh my! Oh sh! Oh my god, bro! Oh man, do I even need to be going in there for that? I don't know if to even attempt that. Oh shit! Aiden, freaking trolling. Fancy putting a Crimson Head Zombie in there to run at ya. Oh, bro. Okay. Um, I think what I might do... Should we make an attempt to try and get past it? Because I'll make a save, but we can also obviously just go on another save if needed. I, I don't know what to do. I don't know if this is optional or we need to go get it. Well, I'm going to have to use that because we're on date caution. <laughs> we'll have to use it. We'll make a save then, obviously. We can restart it if needed. If I'd have known there was a, a thingy in there, I'd have created a save. <laughs> I had no idea. Oh, man. So, yeah, the story with this one, Danny, you, we're playing as Ghost and obviously we've got Hunk accompany, accompanying us. Um... So yeah, but they're responding to a distress call in the um, Acclay Research Facility, so here we are, bro. I am indeed Craig. Um, I am actually free on the 1st of December, so as soon as uh, that strikes, uh, we're going to be playing the RE2 Christmas mod. You have the original Resident Evil 2. I'm so excited. We had a, an absolute blast um, last year playing it. Just gonna have Balder Dash, thank you for stopping in, man. It's a, it's a great mod. So good. Whoa. Okay, that was. Oh my god, there's more. Ooh. Holy shit. We did good on that one. We, we got a little bit of luck there. Oh shit. Oh my. Where's the tools? Where's the tools? Get the toolbox. Oh my god, these are awful. All this for a screwdriver. Bruh. <laughs> this is rough. <laughs> is this even necessary? Like, do we have to do this? I think we've done it. I think we've cracked it. <laughs> we are so beat up. Wow, we did, we did well on that. They are scary, man. I hate crimson heads. They better not be in the mansion. I, I will not be best pleased. They best not be chilling in the mansion. <laughs> Alright, so we're heading back to... Um... It's that conference room, isn't it? See, so yeah, the Christmas body is literally just like the, the standard campaign, but... Um... Like, the items are replaced with, like, like a green herb's like a mince pie, and you can, like, um, combine a green, red, and blue herb to make, like, a, a Christmas dinner and stuff. There we go. Need to lure the guy away. 
Um, and I think the liquors that I don't even know what they are. They make like cat sounds and stuff. It's insane. My bad. One of you up here, don't we? Yeah, when the when the liquors like leap at you, they make like cat sounds and they've got like festive hats on and stuff. It's really cool. Yeah, it's hella fun. But yeah, I've I've got um, other Christmas games lined up as well, guys. So uh, like horror Christmas games. Uh, for next month so yeah we'll get on as much as we can and uh, get a lot of christmas uh, goodness streamed there we go there better be some good shit through here man let's not be trolling us nice operating room key nice it's good man those crimson heads, man, that you do not mess with them. Where can you get this mod, Becca? So it is for the PC. Um, if you just literally search... Um, after the stream, I will I will put a link down below in the uh, description over on YouTube. But if you search Aidan Watkins... Um, if, you, if you literally Google it and it's like the second one down... Uh, it'll take you to his site, um, or just literally Google like Resident Evil Containment Mod, and then uh, it's free to download. You don't need anything else to be able to. You literally just need a PC, obviously. Um, don't need any sort of program or anything to run this. This is a standalone mod, so you just literally download it. It's there in the folder. All the chapters are there in the folder. Oh, bro, look at this! I love, I love how we just put a spin on this room. That's so cool. Take this guy off. Oh. oh bollocks! I went to go round him to use a knife. Oh. I can never get away with using a knifey knife, can I? Couple of little feety bites and we're on dirty caution. So harsh. No, this mod it isn't on console, unfortunately. But yeah, I hook up my controller to play it though. I'm using a PS5 controller to play this. At least those damn crates aren't in here. It's wanting me to move it a little bit. You've got to get this like proper spot on this, or else it, you just will not interact with the vent. That, that might be a bad. Gonna colour work on him, man. Nice. Need some help. <laughs> this place seems to be a morgue. Something is written on the wall in blood. I thought so. He won't give it away easily, even in death. Find him, kill him, search his body. Who's that? Belle, thank you for dropping the rose for us and uh, stopping in tonight. Thank you very much. You say, like, search one's body and stuff. I don't think you can... Um... No, I don't think you can search any of these. Um, no, you don't need, a, like, an actual PC, um, Becca. You can play it on laptop. That'll definitely work. It's not a huge file or anything like that. It's real good. Let me see if we can get in the lab. I won't take any chances with this dude. What's going on, Freddy? We've, we've not been long been playing this, man. Uh, we've been streaming for about 40-ish minutes uh, so far. Oh, I can't get a hit with that knife. Got you, okay. 
Whoa, 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 I keep forgetting I've, I've left him. I'm trying to leave him for now. Yeah, we're gonna go put the power back on, haven't we? I've just realised. Let's go do that. Oh, can we not power it back on? Oh, no! Oh, bro. Just thinking, we don't have to, um... Go put it back on in that room, do we? But usually you, you use that switch, though, don't you? Take a look a second. Um, let's do this again. Wasn't mean one of these bodies was it? Oh, is it this body? Half eaten cops on the operating table. Let me just pop back through there and just see if it's on about a particular body. There's like an alarm going off outside. And it this happened like uh, the other week. I don't know if it's some car alarm or something or some house alarm, I've no idea. It keeps beeping like once every like five seconds. It's like annoying, but like it's actually quite fitting to be honest. With like this facility and just Resident Evil. It sounds like a proper resi alarm. I'm trying to interact with this. It's a, it's a little fiddly this. Let's be over this a sec. Oh, bollocks. Let's move it up slightly. Find him, kill him, and search his body. I'm not sure exactly what it's uh, on about. I don't think there really is, is there? What if I'm just gonna have to check a few of the rooms again? Um, a little confused. Let's look at these ones again. It's not this bro, is it? about this guy might not be I'm not sure Let's give it a try yeah you know what Chrissy I did say um a few of the zombies that they do have Birkin vibes bro this guy's strong <laughs> I just get one little knifey knife in. Are you guys proud? Can't normally use the knifey knife. It must be this guy because he's taking hella bullets. He's taking hella ammo. What an absolute troll this is. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> no way. Nice. There we go. This guy and search his body. Lab card, that's cool. So we need that for somewhere. Was anyone counting how many bullets that was? It has to be like 20 odd, right? It literally could be the OG Tyrant Chrissy. Because can't you defeat Tyrant with like um like 20 odd like pistol shots or something? Yeah, this, this guy looks a little, little bit of uh, Birkin vibes. Mm, it's not this one, is it? Yes. 
We get in there, man. It looks like they perform experiments here. There's a lot of safety equipment around. So there's gotta be some air filters in here. Oh, I thought it meant the other lab. I thought it meant where you fight Tyrant. This is a lab as well, obviously, isn't it? I didn't realise. Oh, now it's got a boomstick. Hell yeah. There is a, like, Tyrant thingy in here as well. Nice. Shit. There's only one air filter here. I better head back and report to Hong. Oh man, we're gonna have to head down there, aren't we, without Hunk? This is where we go alone. Alright, let's go. I refuse, man, I refuse to use any more bullets. There we go. Good man, it's just so cool uh, to play this like from a different perspective, you know. That's what I love about the RE mods, and it feels fresh as well because like, I've, I've generally I've never played them, so it's so cool. If we've got any other health, have we? No, I've got nothing. Got nothing. Uh, we'll pop this in for now. So I haven't got anything for it. Um, Keep the knifey knife on us. Cool. Oh yeah, I was literally uh, just thinking about that. Um, yeah, The Last of Us Part 2 remastered. I, I believe it's January 16th that's releasing. Yeah, I'm really excited for that. And uh, I would love to get that and stream that on launch. Or, um, you know, at least as close to launch as we can, for sure. I really enjoyed um, Last of Us Part 1 Remastered. Yeah, I'm all for that hype, man. It does have um, some extras on it as well. Um, do they have like extra kind of like commentary and things like that? From the people behind the game. And uh, there is a, um, like a, a free mode of, um, of where you can play the guitar as Ellie as well. They've included that. Um, and th there's like a few other things I've included in it, so they definitely make it worthwhile. It's more than just a standard remaster. Yeah, but we have a problem. Hunk, we have there's a problem. One air filter. Hmm. Maybe there's a way to clear the cave of toxic gas. It's possible. There could be some kind of ventilation system. All right, Yuki. Take the air filter and check it out. Contact me by radio when it's safe to enter. All right, we got it. I'm to leave our hope behind. What's going on, Zav? Welcome on in. Great to see you. Hope you're well. You yeah, hope you're doing awesome, Dad. I know you've been playing uh, Far New Vegas, haven't you? Have you been smashing that? Oh man, the caves! Please, these better not be dangerous. Because are you seeing this, man? We're we on dirty caution. We are on dirty caution. I'm a little scared right now. Right, we don't have a little cranky crank, do we, for that? Is there anything around here, though? No, there's nothing. There's nothing. Oh, shit! I'm not sure we're legging it. I've done it before. I, th I think it was on the, more the remake, though. Um, I got, like, the, the camera angles, like, messed up, and I was kind of, like, looking at the wall, then looking away, and I was like, no, just run, and I, like, got it, like, messed up and got crushed by the boulder. So it has uh, happened before. So it does give me the fear a little bit. Just give me a bit of the fear. Oh, no way, your PC's running bad, Zanth. Because of the keyboard. Is it just not agreeing with it or something? That's very weird. That's weird. PCs are so damn complicated. <laughs> they really are. Like, I always have to consult... Uh, my mates were PC goats. I'm very fortunate to have a load of them. I'm just like, mate, can you just sort this out, please? 
I'm not liking knocking around on dirty caution, man. Nice. I do like this music. This is cool. I like the savory music. I'm gonna put the knifey knife in here because I'm hardly using it, am I? Can't really make decent use of it. Let's combine these up because it's annoying me. We can't have separate ribbons. There we go. Stack them up. Right, we'll save it. We'll take the um, first aid with us. It's a great little uh, savoury music, this. It's really nice. Very nice and relaxing. You know, like with the toxic gas spray, and it kind of... If I close my eyes, I kind of like feel like I'm in a spa or something. Like I'm in a sauna, steam room, and I've, I've just got steam around me. Like, yeah. <laughs> But it's actually toxic gas in, in the uh, Resident Evil mines. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. Have you tried like all the troubleshooting stuff for it? Like, that's weird. Um, yeah, my, my stuff's all wired. Um, it's nice to have wireless in it, so they're not everywhere, but yeah. Um, my stuff just happens to be wired. I'm, I'm a bit of a, a razor wanker when it comes to merch. <laughs> I, I love uh, the brand razor. So I've, I've literally got um, most of those. And yeah, they're wired. Okay, so you need a valve handle for over there. I, I assume that's probably to turn off the toxic gas then, I reckon. A bloody bolt. Oh, shit! Oh, bro, that... No, no, no. Don't do this to us. Don't do this. I'm gonna have to take these out, really, aren't I? Oh, man, this is... <gasps> Holy shit! That was boosted camo well spent. They didn't even put us on danger, we still remained on dirty caution. Don't you know I'm still standing better than I ever did? I hadn't even used the first aid yet. I haven't even used it. I, I thought I'd push it. I thought I'd be a bit cocky and push it, you know. There's nowhere else. Is there nowhere else to look at for now? Still need the cranky crank. We need the valve handle. Go in here next. Nice. Yeah, that's that's the other thing about having wireless, isn't it? It's uh, funding batteries for it, right? Yeah, you know, I feel like I'd just rather put up with some wiring, you know, like for for an easy life or an easier life. Control panel for the power generator. There's a warning sign below it. The power generator can cause a cave to collapse. That's good to know. <laughs> now you tell us now we're like balls deep in the cave. All right, then. <laughs> Nice, a crank so as well. Researchers letter. Myself and a group of other researchers were able to escape from the laboratory and were heading to the Spencer mansion. Unfortunately, some of the group were already infected and turned. The group was overcome with panic and many broke off into smaller groups while trying to escape from being eaten alive. During the panic, someone damaged the gas tanks and released toxic gas into the cave. Myself and two others wound up at a dead end in these caves, but it's too late to turn back. I could already feel the effects of the toxic gas on my body. I only wish I could have seen you one last time. Oh, man, was he right into his uh, little boo? Bro, he was, uh, he was, he was right into his uh, bit of booty. I know, man, I know there's... Uh... Oh, man, I'm going to check that. Th these are the arms you always want to fall into. Tony's arms. Always fall into Tony's arms, guys. That's sick. Do, do y'all, any of y'all have, have anything else for us? Just, just some dialogue. 
Well, yeah, it's cool as well, guys, reading out the documents because even they're all all new, you know. Oh, I'm surprised we didn't even pick up the cranks. We didn't even have space for it. I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use that now. But yeah, I'm hella excited, especially for um, on Last of Us Part Two for the little um like free play on the guitar that that would be so cool man because have you guys already seen like the amount of possibilities like amount of like songs and chords and that people have figured out and like that you can play doors block from the other side um yeah you can play like um oh there's all sorts man there's like blue 182 obviously there's take on me there's, there's quite a few there's, there's a lot of stuff a lot of rock ones as well Deep purple, I think. So yeah, just just imagine once once that's released, like a proper free mode on it. Like, I I think it's just gonna spiral. There is gonna be hella, absolutely hella tunes coming out of that. So cool. Gotta get the exact precise spot. Not there. Is it not the right kind of crank? Should be the one here. I thought I was lined up alright for it. Am I not lined up with the thing? There's no dialogue from it. What's going on there, Affy Dealy Force? Welcome on in, bro. So just blasting out, I'm still standing now. Bro, we've had a little, we've had a little sing song with that. It was very warranted because uh, we are on, we we was on dirty caution, and we're in the mines. <laughs> Had to bust that out. That's weird. Can we not use it for that? I can't if there was another little part where we can use the crank. I can't if there was another section. We'll have a look. Been through there. In there. <laughs> I'm on dirty caution in real life 24-7. You know what? I feel the vibes on that. Honestly, you guys warned me when I turned 30 that it, it would go downhill and boy, you weren't kidding. Do you want me to tell you all the ailments I've had? <laughs> um I mean, I, I'm busy like 24-7, like all the time, always busy, um, always prepping for streams, working, sorting my house, seeing everyone and whatever. So I'm always busy, so I can understand why I get tired, but I need naps more than ever now. Um, I get backache often. Um, I've experienced gastric reflux, which I've never had in my life, up until turning 30. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's grim, absolutely grim. <laughs> First aid spray is here. It's here. You can, you can, you guys can have some of that first aid spray if you need it. There you go. <laughs> it's, it is actually, um, it is actually compressed air in here. But if, if I never told you that, like, you, it could have like a, a placebo effect, right? You guys could believe it actually worked. Is there another part with the crank? Oh yeah, the, the other, um, what is that? What the hell was that? Yeah, <laughs> you literally took the words right out of my mouth, ghost. Down here? Oh no. I just put the boomstick ammo back as well. I've still got boomstick, but... Right, so we've been through here, haven't we? Got whatever was there. Right, so we should be able to use it here. There we go. And then, uh, yeah, I think it was like yesterday I woke up and um, I had a trap nerve there. <laughs> it's minging right. Nope. It's a good job Ghost has, has something about it because me, I'd, I'd carry on running and then fall to my death. I think it's like a... I think it's like a hold on there. What's going on, Ian? So this game is fantastic.
it's wicked, right? It, it is good. I just love how they put a spin on the um, on the classic RE games. It's really good. I know you literally think, don't you? Like I, I hate getting old, man. I absolutely hate it. I think what gets me the most, um, the, man, back kick's awful. Oh man. Oh, sh oh my god. But I'm rocking, look at the double denim. I kept my eyes, can't take it. Shit. Bro, I'm, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to defeat these. Oh, they're doing us dirty tonight, man. We're back on dirty caution. It's... Man, freaking, it, like, it literally does feel like um, dirty caution, you know, this vibe. If I had a, a health status, it'd definitely be that. Freaking shout out to all you guys in the 30 plus club, like me. <laughs> I'm only just though, but I'm, I'm already, yeah. I feel like I'm balls deep in it, but I've only just entered it this year. These things must have broken out from here. Well, why can't you build better cells, bro? I've just got my ass kicked. Even bro, even decapitated bro does not even have any pickups for us. This is bullshit. There's usually a nice little puzzle in here. Been absolutely done over. Oh, it's totally losing me in these caves because some areas are like changed up, aren't they? Um, so it's not there. It's a double door room in it where um, where Black Tiger usually is. In here. That's fine. I think I was just our footsteps. I'm, I'm very paranoid right now. There we go. It looks like the toxic gas is starting to clear out. Come, it's Ghost. You got me. Loud and clear. What's the situation? Through the cave of toxic gas. It's safe to enter. Roger that. I'm on my way. Nice. So, can we head in back that way? Nice. Alright, now we can get to this destination. Yes, to the mansion! Actually, there's something we need to do first. What is it? What must it be in these we caves? Need to restore power to the garden elevator. There is a power generator, but it's dangerous to use. What do you mean dangerous? There was a warning that said it made the caves unstable. That's why it was deactivated. Those elevators are the only way up to the mansion. I guess we don't really have much of a choice. Precisely. Let's get moving. So I think they were back this way. Oh, it's not that way. <laughs> Thanks for telling me, ghost. This way? I'm mean, indeed done. Yeah, yeah, play nerd with the controller for sure. It's gonna cop me, Chris. Welcome on in, bro. That's it. Let's get the boomstick ammo. Yeah, I just feel it makes um, makes playing so much easier with the controller for sure. Did you guys see me when I when I gave in towards the end of uh, the first Alan Wake stream we did, <laughs> and I tried to defeat that boss with keyboard and mouse. I was like losing my shit. I was like this close to getting a little bit genuinely mad. <laughs> it takes a hell of a lot for me to be genuinely mad. I was it, I was getting a bit pushed to it. And again, we was balls deep into the stream. It was like 1 or 2 a.m. or something. You know? Yeah, I think it's like through here. <laughs> I agree, Sam. That's a red flag with keyboard. I don't know how anyone 
can, can use it. You could tell the difference when I switched to um, when I switched to controller. I'm at way smoother, like at that boss. There we go. All right. the power's been restored to the garden. So we're gonna have to leg it out. I bet we're gonna have a time limit now. Awesome. There better not be some shit come up, man. Oh, bless us. <laughs> I think, like, literally all of us guys get backache. Oh, no. No. He was literally right with us. Oh, bollocks. Alright, we've lost Hong, but hopefully he'll find a way out. I reckon we'll be reunited with him in, in a future episode for sure. I reckon we will. Um, so we need to be... Um, we get out here. Almost a ghost me. sandwich. Damn it! No, bro, don't write home. Cough, he'll be hurry fine. And get to that mansion. I won't lose her too. Yeah, it's gotta go find our sis. Go find our little sister. Oh, this music, man! This slaps. Oh, finally some herbs. Praise the herb lords. Hell yeah! <laughs> Guys, can you can you mind your language in my chat? Saying that pineapple does not belong on pizza. Excuse me. Excuse me. Why are you coming in my swamp and saying this? <laughs> Bruh, it is so nice. It absolutely belongs on pizza, man. Like, how how can you like, how can you not allow it? Like a little sweet here. It's like a little sweet kick on pizza. How can you not allow it, fam? Bruh. You know what? I, I do get a bit paranoid when I order um, ham and pineapple pizza from Domino's. I always think that they're, they're spitting it before they send it to me. I think if I get the wrong person, they're going to totally spit in it before uh, it gets dispatched to me. But yeah, guys, that is the end of episode one. So we will go on to episode two. There are four episodes uh, overall. So we'll just quit out of that. I'm dying to get on to the next one. So we're in the Spencer Mansion. I'm so happy. We've been around all the minging, the absolute minging. Um, research facility, the labs, uh, the caves. I'm so glad we've got the caves done, bro. <laughs> we seem a bit divided in the chat. Thank you. Thank you, guys, my, my uh, pineapple on pizza crew. Appreciating you. People standing up for me in my own swamp. <laughs> the graphics, man. The ass, that's so good. Oh, this is exciting. The little cricket sounds, the dog howls. Episode two, a house divided. Yeah, it's me and you guys and them. Yes! Spencer Mansion. She has to be here somewhere. I better hurry. Thank you, I'm abysmal for coming in and sending over the GGs. Thank you very much, bro. Yeah, it sounds like everyone has backache. Um, so yeah, I'll tell you what's good, Ian. I, I love deep heat. Oh man, even all the crests are in. There are beautiful gold crests placed here. Nothing useful. They look, they look pretty as they are. They, they look lovely. Nice. Got a little boomstick. No ammo carried over or anything, but we good. We good. But yeah, deep heat spray's good. It's very strong smelling, but it's good, though. Who turned out the lights? 
That cave collapsing must have destroyed the power generator and cut off power to this mansion. Oh, we have to be very careful. Oh, don't Who say that. What could be lurking in the darkness? Oh no! You guys, you've got to be super observant now, guys. Please, you've got to be checking the shadows for me, please. Oh man, I've got you agreed as, as as well, Dean. Said hell yeah, pineapple on pizza is a must. It's an absolute must. We've got to stand up for what we believe in, okay? <laughs> yeah, speaking of backache, I I always say this like. If you notice, I'm always hunched over playing games. I've literally got such a like a state of the art razor chair with like a lumbar support. I never sit back into the chair. I never recline it like that. I never relax. I'm literally upright and hunched forward. <laughs> and I wonder why I've got backache. <laughs> I can't help it. I get all immersed into the games. I need to like be like in the game, you know. You know what, Becca? I did think of something before I press this switch. I did um, see something that Domino's posted earlier, and I thought of you, Becca, because um, you're a fan of the barbecue base, aren't you? Where did they say it? Let me find it. They said... There we go. Um... So obviously, if you did watch a football last night, Harry Kane got a yellow card, and it was very undeserved. And it like it was like, what the hell? Why? Uh, like, what was that even for? That it was definitely an officiating like error. Uh, so Domino's Pizza posted the status uh, just after saying that Kane booking was the worst decision since Barbecue Base. Becca, I think you need to you need to be tweeting Domino's. You need to be um, getting a little compensation from them there. <laughs> the same Barbecue Base is an awful decision. You need to be calling out dominoes. <laughs> I can only see moonlight and dense forest. Come on. Can you see the moon in there? Dancing in the moonlight. Every bird. Yes. Freaking love a bit of dancing in the moonlight. You know what, I, I actually love that. You know when you're on the dance floor and you hear the intro? I do, I'm just literally like that. I like literally stop what I'm doing. I'm like, holy shit. <laughs> love a bit of dance in the moonlight. Uh, Becca, go on their Facebook page. It's over on their Facebook page. That is where you need to call them out. Um, I'm not sure if it's on any other platform, but I thought I should inform you. It did uh, remind me of you when you was on about your barbecue base. So I know, I know you. You're all about that base. Becca's all about that base. No treble, please. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's a zombie. I'm unsure. If he... <laughs> I'm unsure what it was. Booty right in the way. Have I got a little knifey knife? Oh, is his bro dead? Oh, he's dead, he's dead. This is what a vibe this is though, guys. The Spencer Mansion light with all the power off. I have had barbecue based uh, pizza. It's not like my absolute go-to, but it's really nice though. Um because my um what like one of our local pizza places, our go-to that we always have. Um, it does like a, it's not a meat feast, but it's called Mighty Meat, the one that I like. It's got um, pepperoni, salami, and uh, doner meat, and that's on a barbecue base, and it proper works with it, a million percent it works. It's so nice. Yeah, but you go tell them, Becca. You stand up for what you believe in. Looks like Leon Kennedy in a freaking lab coat. Bruh. To be fair, that could be any one of the Birkins, because they've all got a cheeky bob and they? they've all got the same hairstyle, the Birkins. The body of a researcher, so they did make it back. Oh, bless him. You, you'd want to, if, if you knew you was going to die, like, of the virus, like, you, you'd want to make it in here, wouldn't you, right? At least bro made it. He looks real peaceful down there, you know? We'll leave bro to uh, R.I.P. Right. That needs to go there, that needs to go there. Cool. All look good to go. The rest of the mansion needs to be super nice to us. Uh, yeah, I'm so glad that loads of you guys are in uh, agree. We've got Mr. Bipster, we got uh, Jane and Ian. 
trust me, I'm not even making these names up. Um, like everyone is like in agreement, like pineapple does belong in pizza. Hell yeah, hell yeah, guys, my pineapple and pizza crew. That's cray cray with these lights, man. That little green tinge is so cool. So cool, man. I quite like th these zombies. They're, they're quite low maintenance, you know. Just a few, few cheeky shots and they're done. This looks so cool, man. How cool is this? Let's head over this way. Yeah, we'll take a look, Jay. So that one's locked. Too dark to see what key is required. Oh, yeah, it makes sense. You think, fuck all. <laughs> You'll be able to see what key, yeah, keys you need for what doors. What's going on, Gemma? Thank you for being in. What's huh. this guy? What the? So researcher is still alive? Oh, who are you? What are you doing here? Are you from the rescue team? I'm with the Umbrella Security Service. We were sent here after receiving the distress call. Huh. Well, you're too late to help anyone now. Everyone's either dead or become living dead. This wound hurts. Are you alright? What happened? I was attacked by one of the infected in our group. I barely escaped, but the others, they weren't so lucky. Was there a woman in the group? Early 20s, blonde hair? You mean Tracy? Where is she? Oh, sister. Is she alright? Our group got separated during the attack. The others went to the guardhouse. I don't know if she's alive. The guardhouse? Why? What's so special about it? It has an armory full of weapons and ammo. Without them, there's no way anyone could survive this. All right, where is the guardhouse located? You can get there by going through the garden. Take the elevator. It's just past the big metal gates. Got it. I'll make my way there. Wait. Before you go, can you help me? I need medical supplies to treat this wound. There's got to be some around here somewhere. Everyone if loves a bit of cowpaw. Please bring it to me. I know you're chasing after if some cowpaw, bro. I'll make it worth your while. You won't get past the traps without it. All right. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. But please, hurry. Come on, all right. You only just told us now. You just want it here instantly. Bro. No problem. We got it. No, Becca, keep scrolling. You Go go back on Domino's page on Facebook. you got to keep scrolling because it's, it's got the little meme of Harry Kane where he's like, huh? And then it says when mum says to get frozen pizza, you gotta keep scrolling. It's a couple of posts down from that. The status still remains, I tell you. <laughs> yes, Mike. Yes, man. Looks like we're going to the guardhouse indeed, my dude. I'm so excited. Hella excited. So we need to be, is this, uh... We need to be the other side of the hall. Um... Actually, yeah, we need to go... Get there up here. Can't even see a room here. Use the mantra key, nice. Yes, we'll go down this corridor, go through the main hall. We, we need to go to the other save room uh, on the other side of the mansion. Nearly had a freaking smooch with this guy. Yeah, go get this guy the cow pulse so he stops whinging. They all love a bit of the cow pole in this game. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate you, bro, for dropping uh, the diamonds. Thank you, man. Nice. The bro seems saucy. Yeah. Everyone does, man. Honestly, trust no one. I can't see anything past this darkness. It's too dangerous to continue this way. Really? Bro, you won't even walk down a few stairs. You fucking pussy, you went for umbrella. 
What's going on, Adam Ski Wines? Welcome on in, uh, bro. Yes, Hoster, what are you saying? Bro, I'm saying nobody better than we. What are you saying, bro? Thanks for being in. Appreciate you. Calpol solves everything. Yeah, I'm not going to explore anything just yet. So we're going to have to go, um... Let's go downstairs and go to the, uh, the main hall that way. Let's make us go out the long way. Why would you give us this key? To access the upstairs when, the, when there's nothing... What is that noise? Huh? That sounded like the elevator in the garden. Did somebody just use it? Oh no. I have to go and investigate. Oh no, don't. I don't want to go back out. I just want to chill in here. Bro. Gemma, thank you for coming in with the subscription. Appreciate you subscribing over on the tubes. Thank you very much. So kind of you. Thank you, Gemma. Appreciate your support. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Adam's saying that you're on those resi mods again. Bro, there's so many of them. We've got to play loads of them. We've got to play them all. <laughs> What's going on, Olivia? I said, hello, stranger. I should investigate the noise of the guy. Oh, bro, I don't want to go outside. We're freezing our tits off all, all stream up until now. We get to spend some matches like, yeah, we're going to die. <laughs> bro. Unreal. Unreal. Thank you, Gemma. I do appreciate you said love your content. Thank you very much. Well, well, yeah, that, that's it, I'm, I'm abysmal. Well, at least we are going to be dancing in the moonlight with whatever is out there. Oh, don't. I don't want to go. Oh, no. Is gone. <laughs> Somebody used it. But who? I'll have to find another way down to the guardhouse. So we're going to need the cranky crank out to drain that water at the fountain. How can he not just jump down and then just land on his ass? Surely he's in that uniform, his, his booty is padded out. Even I would risk that. Surely it would be like a quite a cushioned landing. Uh, what's going on, Aaron? Welcome on in, bro. Appreciate you. I hope those zombies are behaving tonight. Oh, bro, they're all out for us tonight. They all be out for us. We can do a little spando belly hair as well. Uh, Zap said, where did you get your hoodie from? So it is actually part of a tracksuit. Um, I don't know if you've heard of um, a YouTuber. Uh, and he's also on Twitch as well. He's called Syndicate. Syndicate Project. He started off doing COD Zombies. Um, huge, huge um, figure in the gaming world. Um, yeah, he, he vlogs and stuff as well nowadays. Still does bits of gaming when he can around family life. There we go, because we are freaking gold, guys. I'll get our sound light on in a little bit. Oh, bro, not another way to the guardhouse. I haven't even finished looking through the mansion, bro. Another way to the guardhouse. I've just got to have a look. But yeah, um, this is his tracksuit. I've, I've actually got the same one, but in black. It's really nice. Like, it kind of doesn't do it justice on stream, um, but like even like the text, like... The way that is, it's like a rubber material, it's so nice. Um, he's bringing out a Christmas jumper on the 23rd. Um, so I've literally got my eyes set on that, so I'll be watching like a hawk and ordering my mouse. like I could drain the water from here. But I need some kind of tool to operate it. Maybe I can find something back at the mansion. Let's go. As much as I love dancing in the moonlight, it's a little little suspect with the cricket noises and the uh, the doggos barking. But yeah, I'm glad, bro. I'm glad um said you got me into Bio Rand. So naturally got to check out the RE mods. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad, bro. I'm really glad uh, you've got into Bio Rand. I'd, I'd recommend it to anyone. It puts such a cool spin on it. It's so good. Yeah, so good, Becca. I did actually reach out to uh, Noble Chairs, who have uh, not long released uh, Resident Evil gaming chairs uh, with the um umbrella logo on, uh, for those of you who have not seen it. I did actually mean to post a link in the Discord, so I do apologise. Um, I will post a link at some point. Oh, use the sword key, nice. Before we progress, I just literally want to... Um... 
There's a couple of rooms that I've not yet checked out. What's going on, Chris? Work one in. Yeah, they look incredible. I'm gonna deposit that. Might just make a little save, just just to be just be safe, you know. Because mods and stuff, they can be like prone to just random crashing and things like that. It's, it's very rare, but um, yeah, you've definitely got to uh, cover yourself. So I'm actually pretty happy I can head on over. I'll do our little cheeky gold. There we go, guys. Where's my little cheeky gold? There we go. Had to be done. Uh, guys, let me just do a little uh, belated uh, roses jam. Thank you guys for coming in tonight. Bella's just sent a rose over, so thank you very much. I will one day be posh enough um, with a little a little sound thingy where I can just, just tap it up the sounds. We will get there. We'll soon be balling. Oh, bless you, Gemma. That's so kind of you to say. That's so kind. You guys are too nice. And if you ever feel down, Hostel would put a smile on your face. <laughs> Anytime. I'm always here uh, for you guys. Oh, still got to get this guy's cowpole on. I'm here for all of you guys, except this dude who needs the cowpole. He's been crying out for this, bro. But I want to I wanna go explore. Oh, we need to light that, don't we? Got ya. Oh, we can go in here. What the hell was that? It was Lisa Trev Trev. Where was that little Lisa Trevor? As if. As if. I have got some boomstick ammo if she does start. A gentle breeze is coming from the fireplace. She better not start, I'm telling you. An old piano. It seems to be missing two keys. All right, then. Got to find a couple of keys for the grand piano. Hopefully we can play a little Moonlight Sonata. Thank you, Adam, for sharing the life. Man, I, I was all ready to get in, uh, in defensive mode. That's my little defensive mode. <laughs> Bless you, Gemma. I'm so glad, um, you know, the streams bring pos positive vibes to yourself. I know there's nothing else to really go by here. There, there was a, a, a door down the corridor. I just want to check. So there's this one. That's usually where the um, the plant is where we use the chemical, I think, right? No, it's not that one. This one. Nice. Boomstick ammo. Trev trust my hubby's game is like back in 2K. <laughs> You know, I find so sad 2K, like, it, I, I literally, you, you literally think it's like two years ago, but it's like almost a quarter of a century ago, isn't it? Man, it's so sad. The body of a security guard. It doesn't look like they were bitten. What could have done this? He got hunted down, did he, by a hunter? Bro was slacking. Can't go back through there, that's blocked off. Yeah, I just want to check all these rooms, man, for pickups before we, um... Before we go get this guy's cowpole. Got to think of ourselves first, you know. Too dark to see what keys are required. Right, so that's fine. I think we've checked. Have we checked everything else? Did I check this door? Right, locked from inside. Obviously nothing to do on that side of the mansion because everything's too dark. So we'll go downstairs and go in that room where we use the sword key. Oh, we do need to thingy, don't we? I know it's for the map, but I'm just going to go um, light that fireplace just in case we get anything else, because sometimes you, you never know with these mods. So we'll go do that. Um, yeah, sounds good, Lou. I hope uh, hope your RE3 uh, playthrough goes well, man. Let's 
going on, Craig? I hope you're well. Are you still on the COD grind, Craig? I've not actually played any this week. I think I, I played last played some. Um... Oh, the music, Scott. It's a good job we did that. I actually just thought it was a, a map. That's really cool. Um, yeah, I've not played some since like, earlier this week. So we can't actually take the the map. That was just for the music, Scott. That's cool. So we'll have to keep that, won't we? Uh, for that piano in the next room. So we're, we're going to need a couple of uh, piano keys as well for that. So I'm going to deposit this for now. Plus the lighter, I think. I don't think we'll need it anywhere else. Really. Uh, what do I have for tea, Sam? I had. Um, I've, I've literally not got much in. I've like, you obviously, usually I order the gusto meals where you get the um, ingredients and everything, then you cook up the meals. But obviously, I'm going to be premier in in it um, uh, from uh, like Monday onwards. Uh, yeah, so for those of you who don't know, I am on a work course from Monday onwards. Um, it's going to be for like a like quite a number of weeks. I'm going to put them booms to Calo back for now. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's going to be kind of four weeks like at a time sort of thing and like a few weeks like back in my normal job on the road and then back in the classroom for so many weeks and so yeah from like the monday to friday i'm like in a premiere in um like an hour away from like my home um so yeah like i say i, I get meals provided they're very lucky uh, so i've not really got like anything in um Severed arm, hold it. Oh my god, the arm is still attached to the lamp. That's insane. So yeah, anyway, sorry, this is a really long-winded way of, of answering your question. But um, yeah, I had to like just go for something pretty simple. So I just had tuna and rice. And, uh, and I had a little protein yoghurt after. Because I, I know Ho Big Hall had to get stacked with the stream. So she got on the protein yoghurt. <laughs> something is blocking the door. It cannot be opened. Well, it is the Jill sandwich room. Oh, that's great, Jeff. I used to be a carer. I used to be a carer before I worked uh, in the ambulance service. We, we do look after everyone. I mean, look at me grinding away through a Spencer mansion looking for some cowpole to heal this old dude. <laughs> it's too thick to drain from the bathtub. Maybe I could thin it with hot water. You what? Since when are we done shite like this? Hey! Thin it with hot water? The toilet is filled with blood. Man, it's usually very well kept in the uh, in the OG. Bruh, what is with this room? Okay. Insane. Oh! <laughs> Don't sneak up on me like that. You know I can't see anything. Because all the lek is out. This is how bad it is in the UK. This is literally like walking around my house. All the lights off, turning every light off behind me. You know what, though? I have actually splashed out tonight. I've got the heating on as we speak. While we stream, as we speak, the heating is on. Because uh, I thought if I'm going to be in the Premier Inn quite a bit, I, I can enjoy the heating while I'm here because I'm saving on the... Uh, saving on the heating while I'm in the Premier Inn. <laughs> so, I'm treating us, man. <laughs> Imagine trying to maintain the Spencer Mansion in this cost of living crisis. Like, I'd be so happy. Like, I'd be crying tears of joy because I'd be happy to own such a mansion. But I'd be crying tears of sadness because I can't maintain such a mansion. You know? <laughs> Insane. That's a shout, Sam. I love a good stir fry. Hell yeah. Oh, bro, I knew I'd need it. A rusty boiler. Maybe I could ignite it with something. Let's go back this way. Go get the night. Uh, the uh, lighter. Yeah, imagine. I've I've had to I've had to leave Lurpak in the past. I have had to leave it in the past, guys. I, like I think an absolute shout is Dane Pack. It's an absolute shout from uh, Lidl. That is the way to go nowadays. Let's take that lighter. Let's go. I, I do love cathedral cheese as well. I have, um, I have, like, I, I did have mature cheese, right? And I thought at one, one point, like, this is proper adult life conversations, this, guys. This is unreal. 
Uh, yeah, even Adam says Dane Pack is banging, mate. Honestly, I was so reluctant to make the change, but you have to take these steps, man, in this cost of living crisis. I absolutely underestimated. I thought, oh, it's a load of bollocks. I'll be all right. I won't change my ways. And it's like, oh, I'm having to reevaluate things, you know. Um, but yeah, love Cathedral Cheese. Um, I went from mature to extra mature. Haven't looked back. Yeah, lo love the extra mature cheese. It's worth making the leap. Just FYI. <laughs> the boiler is now lit. This will provide warm water to the mansion. Okay. Can we pop back to the bathtub then and run the hot water? Researcher's memo. The accident may not be such a bad thing after all. As one of the lead researchers on the T-Virus project, I've had access to a lot of valuable data. I've made copies of all the research data and reports. This stuff will be worth millions of dollars to those who wish to exploit the power of the T-Virus. Umbrella have turned their back on us, so I'm turning my back on them. I've spent my life working on this research, and it's about time I get what I finally deserve. Yeah, it's cool how all the, the documents are new as well. Right, so let's take a look in here. We might need something else, but... I can try running the tap. We can we can give it a go. Filled with coagulated blood. Will you use the hot water and unplug it? There we go. Yeah, science, bish. Call me Jesse Pinkman. I knew all those years of watching Brainiac would be worth it. Do you guys remember Brainiac? Yeah, I got one of the piano yeah. keys. Come on. What is that? <laughs> There's like an arm left in there. Thank you, Gemma, for the diamonds. Massively appreciate you. Thank you for your support tonight. Let's go deposit those in, in the box because I, I ain't got room for anything else. I ain't got any more room in the booty. Yes, Craig. Tiger bread is the one. What a goat bread tiger bread is. So nice. You know, I don't, I've had that since I've had my little braces. I'm looking forward to getting rid of my braces. Um, yeah, I wanted a little work done on my teeth. I wanted, like, um, some composite bonding and whitening, but there was, like, they need to be straightened out more. It's mainly the, the, the bottom set. I just had crowding, and they were just a bit wonky and stuff. And they did cause me dental pain for some years, so I was like, you know what? I was like, well, um, I was like... I'll, I'll get braces on them and uh, straighten them out. They look so good, like, you know, just, like, so nice and straightened out. And, um... I could have had like black, um, I think I, I think it was like, yeah, like like a, a dark grey or like a black or um, I think clear ones. They didn't look right though. The black ones look too, not my thing. But the gold ones are cool, man. The gold ones are cool. Let's freaking, freaking shout out to my braces. <laughs> shout out to my damn braces. It, it's my American rapper look, so I will be in a way, I will be quite sorry to lose them. Um... But yeah, um, I should have them for about three to six months and then they go. Bless you, that you are a good and you do look, look after everyone, you. Rather run about for everyone and that. Uh, Craig, I've played a little bit of Zombies on the new card. It's alright, it's not too bad. I do prefer the classic style though, where it's all round based. Um, but it's pretty cool though. Uh, I am enjoying it. It is pretty cool. Right, so I think we're good to progress for now. Remember the cowpole. Guys, don't forget to remind me for the cowpole. Don't let me forget. You better have some Tony's arms for us under there, bro. Oh, that's done as dirty. Let me just go back out and see if we can push it the other way. I'm getting desperate now. <laughs> I need some Tony's arms. Please. <laughs> Bless you, that. But we love whole grills. <laughs> yeah, gotta love the grills, man. You know what? I've got used to them. I've proper got used to them. Oh, it's done as dirty. I wonder if we can push this one. No, there's nothing, there's nothing under him. Aiden, you could have put some under these for us, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Rookie mistake. Rookie move. 
A little smooch. A little smooch from behind there. Now imagine that outside in the courtyard. Dancing in the moonlight. Fucking smooch in the moonlight. What's going on, Benny V? Welcome on in, man, over on Twitch. Oh, I never usually go down here. Because it's usually... Usually don't really serve any purpose. I was hoping to get past, but... Come all the way out. Come all this way. Come on, keep walking. Because this is Thriller, Thriller Night. Keep walking. Keep walking. Come on, I want you to hit us with the thing. Come on. Where is he? Oh, come on, don't glitch, man. Come on, I want you to hit us with the thing. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Dun -dun. This is Thriller. Come on. Get out of the way, bro. I want to go down there. He's like, no, this is my territory. There we go. Nice. Right, nothing else down here, so we need to be a little evasive here. Lovely. I think that's the armor key, if I remember right. Looks it. There we go. Broken statue is blocking the door. I held my breath then. I was like, the, the doggos better not jump through those windows, man. If those windows go through, I am gone. But yeah, guys, hope you're all having an awesome Saturday evening. Thanks for joining me tonight. Proper appreciate you guys turning up. But yeah, what are you guys up to tonight? Are you guys uh, gaming yourselves? Or are you chilling? Is that nothing through there? Is that black blocked? Let's go through. We went in there, didn't we? Cheers that rose, Chris. Appreciate it. Yeah, I know some of you guys, um, are, you know, gaming yourselves or some, some of you guys are just chilling watching the stream. Yeah, let us know what you're up to, though. Yeah. Gemma says, I'm gaming with cricket. Nice. What are you... Are you gaming with cricket on in the background? And us on in the background as well? Bro, there's usually an armor key for that. That's usually an armor key. I'm a little confused. Nice. Teetzel's chilling watching the stream. Sounds good. Zab said chilling with a cup of tea watching my fave. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, girl. I'm okay. Yeah, appreciate you guys. Massive love to you all. How'd you have your cup of tea? I have my tea and coffee. I have them all with milk and two sugars. But I'm so particular about it though, man. You, you've started me off, man. I, I, will, I will tell you right guys sometimes at work people are nice enough to you know offer to make you a drink but do, so, do some of you guys politely decline and then pretend that you've changed your mind and then be like oh i will make one actually then you go make one yourself because i always do someone asked me the other whoa why is there a bee here the bee specimen bruh is, is our elton john bee around i love our little elton john bee don't you know i'm still standing there's one in the guard, guard house that has like uh it has like uh, purplish light -like, tinted uh, shades on. But yeah, so, someone asked me a little while ago, um, I was in the kitchen at work and, uh, you know, said, do you want a brand? I was like, uh, oh no, I had a brew on the go, but they had the milk out, right? And it was a, a two, is it two pint now? What's the big one? I can't remember what, um, what volume it is, but the big carton, the big carton, like, like the, it's like a huge carton to me, right? I have to hold it with both hands. But, um, Yes, they had that, and I had everything in there, The everything but the milk in mine, all prepared. I was waiting for the milk from a colleague, and then there was like, oh, tell me when, and then they held it over the thing. I fucking, I, my heart was literally like that. I was like, no, 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 I was like, I'm good, I'm good, I'll add the milk. And then there was like, they looked at me so shocked, and people were like, oh, all right then, isn't she so particular, whatever. I was like, no, 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 you don't play milk roulette with your colleagues. You don't let people make you a drink. Well, I can't anyway, because I need it strong. 
I, I need mine strong, you know. Yeah, they'll put way too much milk in, then there's no going back, you know. Oh, is that it, Bella? Six pie. Yeah, the, the huge one. The absolute huge one. <laughs> We've been everywhere but the room for this guy's Calpol. I can't help him, man. The, all, all the places are, like, barricaded off. Bro will be fuming. Popping the bee specimen. There we go. Sounds like something was open. Not a tiny splash of milk, like... I don't know, maybe, maybe a few small splashes of milk. I don't know, there's like a bit, but I still have it like quite strong. Danny said, on the lookout for a new game after finishing Dead Space. Well, you know what, bro? I don't know how popular my opinion is, but um, I did play um, Callisto Protocol, but I, I didn't really like it. Gotta say, I was really let down with um, Callisto Protocol, bro. Um, but yeah, Dead Spacey vibe. Hmm. I wonder if you've, if you play that Alien Isolation or like Prey. I've not played either game, but I've had I've had Alien Isolation recommended to me a lot. Um, yeah, I want to get into some more sci-fi horrors. You know, it's been it's been a while. Right, so we'll go get the other piano key and the music uh, score, then we'll head back. Yeah, I just wasn't keen on it, Danny. Um, wasn't too drawn with the story. Uh, I thought it was pretty clunky. Uh, there were some parts of the game like where there was like a few too many enemies. It was just so clunky, everything, you know? Um, yeah, I definitely need to prioritise Alien Isolation. I will, guys. So many people have asked me to stream it. So we will have that coming up, I promise you guys. Full show. I might take a little green hair with us. I'm going to leave that behind. Because I have a feeling something's going to come out. Like, Because usually you fight Yon for the second time. Um, I'm going to uh, combine those. We've literally just about got enough room for stuff. So I'm just going to go make a little save. Make a cheeky save. Get the boomstick. Uh, I have green top milk. Um, yeah, we used to have like blue top like years ago, but then we just got into the green one, and I like it. I think the red one, that's like the, the zero fat one or something, isn't it? Like, um, unskimmed or whatever, in it. And then, uh, obviously green's like the semi-skimmed. I think it's just right. I like the, the green top. I think it's just right, you know? Be warned, it's scary. Oh, wow. Yeah, lots of people have said it's scary. I do trust you guys. Did you actually say if you played in VR? Oh, man, that's terrifying. Is, it, is, is that even a word, or have I invented that term myself, unskimmed? What's the red milk called? Come on, we learn something new every stream, or at least I do. What's the, what's the red milk called? Unskimmed. Or no fat. I can't remember what it is. <laughs> I, can't, I can't remember. Gemma said, you need to teach me. Oh, red is skimmed. Eh? Oh, right. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. How do you guys even know that? Everyone is commenting skimmed. How do you guys even know that? <laughs> Well, what's the blue one then? Is the blue one uns unskimmed? So if the red one's skimmed and the green's semi-skimmed, that's a bit skimmed. What's the blue one? Is that like, um, that must be unskimmed then. <laughs> blue is whole milk. I, my mind's like blown right now. I'm just like, what? I'm, I'm just, a, I'm gonna just stick with G Fuel. Like, let's just identify it by the red, green and blue, okay? Just like our herbs. Let's not be on about this skimming business because this is too much for me. I'm out of my G fuel and pipe down. This is too much. <laughs> I came here to play survival horror, not talk about how skimmed milk is. <laughs> Insane. Oh, I'm so glad that you've um you've done well uh with your sorting your collection out, uh Dean. Sorted my PS4 collection, I found three of the same game and five other doubles. Bro, which ones? Which ones uh if, if you got like a doubles, that's insane you've got like duplicate copies. That's mad. Um, <laughs> I'm getting absolutely trolled uh, in the chats for, for not knowing all these skimmed milks and what. It's too much, too much, man. Uh, Gemma said, you need to teach me how to play RE3. Did you say you've not completed it before? 
yeah honestly Gemma I've been playing it quite a bit like when we have some chill streams so um yeah, yeah. feel free to to watch some streams back or like like I say I, I will stream it pretty soon um like I say I will be doing some premiere in streams um gaming streams uh, from there uh just from my phone because uh, obviously limited setup I can't take my pc with me um so I will be just doing whatever means to stream like use whatever means we've got um, so it'll just literally be like pointing my um, phone at the at the TV, basically. Uh, but yeah, I'm taking my, my Xbox with me. I'll take a PS1 and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, we'll be doing that. But yeah, <laughs> Rob said, literally tuned in. I thought you were doing a milk quiz. Oh, bro, just... No, it's not a milk quiz. It's just the usual holster roasting in the chat. Um, but yeah, we, we were just debating the, the, the milks. I was like, what is the... Because I know that the green is semi-skimmed because I have that milk. And then I was like... What's the blue? That not, that's full fat. In that fully, I said in that fully skimmed or something, and then the red one's unskimmed or something. I I thought that it was like that. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, let's all chill with the Moonlight Sonata. <laughs> Absolute scenes, man. No weird shit turn up. It sounded like a heavy object was moved. Like what? I mean, I know that statue was blocking the way to the main hall. Well, will you climb through? Okay, because uh, climbing through a fireplace always seems like a good idea. Yeah, I would tell you guys, I didn't know... Um, what kind of milks they all were. Oh, it is yours as well. Oh, it's um, Lisa Trevor. Lisa Trev Trev. Usually you can't kill her. I'm going to see if we can just leave her. You guys are absolutely milking it in the chat. Some Tony's arms. Tony's arms. Get the Tony's arms. Oh, they're over here. No, no, Becca. You have not done a, a milk and herb crossover. No, 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 no. We can't rename the herbs. We've got red, green, and blue herbs. That's it. No skimmed and unskimmed or leafed or unleafed herbs. None of that. Oh, you're kidding. Have I got to, I've got to defeat this bitch. Right, we, we've got to defeat this bitch. Okay. Lisa Trev Trev. I know, right, Rob? It's utterly ridiculous how you guys are trolling me. <laughs> yeah, that's how that's how weird it sounds. If I was to say all the herbs are like fully leafed and semi-leafed and unleafed. Oh, Lisa Trev Trev, she she ain't in the mood. <laughs> she, do you get it? She ain't in the mood. Ow! Music's off. Mic drop. That, that, that is literally me when I turn up at my mum's house for tea. I literally collapse at the doorstep like that and I just go, Mother! It's literally me on my mum's doorstep. Oh man. <laughs> oh man. At least Craig's got my back, man. He's, he's been uh, spamming over the um, the lemon and herb emojis over on the tubes. Thank you, Craig. It makes me happy. It takes the the milk shame away. Oh, bro, I need the uh, I need the lighter again. We need it for this candle. I'll, t I'll take it. We do anyway. It's too dark to see anything. I can see it. Nice. Oh, Jebba, keep going with it. Like, you will complete RE3. Um, you know what? Like, if you're not used to kind of, you know, going through it a lot of times, like, it did used to take me a long time to um, go through and complete it, but... 
I, I can whisper it a bit more smoothly now. It's just repetition. You've got to keep going at it. But if you let us know what we're stu you're stuck on my or anything, just God. give us a shout. My Did God. that thing back in the attic do this? Lisa Trev, Trev, I thought she was um, pretty harmless. I thought she just wanted to find her mama, didn't she? What's the shield key for? So we came through that door. Hmm. <laughs> I ain't never, I mean, ain't never afraid to show off my love for lemon and herb. I ain't ever afraid. Hmm. It's not for this one, is it? Shield key? Hell yeah. Yeah, the shield key. It's usually a single use key for the room we just fought Lisa Trevor in. This is a rather strange looking room. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. Oh, don't say that. Someone's... Oh, what? The temperature of the room's become unbearable. Oh, bollocks. Oh, we're on danger. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh. What? I was actually in there for two seconds. Oh, what a troll. What a troll. Oh, man, we're going to have to restart it, I'm afraid. Uh, well... Um, from our last save. We did save, don't we? We did save. Because I think I did it before we went and uh, fought... Yeah, this is the guy. This is the guy behind it all. The freaking troll. Aiden Watkins. Bruh. Oh, bro. You know, I actually feel boiling after that room. I think I'm, I'm just going to take the hoodie off, actually. I'm going to switch the heating off for now, okay? Because I'm not loaded. Just give me a sec. I'm going to go switch the heating off a sec. I'm totally good at moaning that I'm cold in there in a couple of minutes, but still. I'm rocking the G Fuel top though tonight. We saved 10 minutes ago. It ain't all bad, it's fine. Yeah, that, that's it, Belle. There's no use uh, crying over spilt milk with that death. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Mike. <laughs> I know, look at me. Freaking free advertising, man. The freaking G Fuel. All over it, I am. All over it. Okay. Uh, should be fine. As long as we don't get proper beaten up, I think we'll be fine. Um, so we'll take that. We'll take the... What's I taken? Music score. Let's go play that beautiful Moonlight Sonata. Thank you, Gemma, for dropping that diamond. Oh, no, Gemma. I, I ain't opening the window. I ain't falling for that again. Um, where are we going? Just going up there. Um, yeah. Yeah, got it. I ain't falling for that again. The amount of moth carcasses I've had to clean up in here because a, a million of them would fly through every stream when I needed to open the window. Then they just stay here. <laughs> it's so bad. They stay here and then, like, they can't live in here and they just drop. And I've ended up with carcasses on the floor and it, it saddens me, man. You know? Yeah, they choose to come in here. They, the cast of a book's life comes in here rent free. Whenever I want to, um, ever want a bit of fresh air, you know? So I have to just stay in here and uh, be all stuffy in the streaming cave. Uh, Dean said, where'd you get your G Fuel from? So, um, it's just now and again I do order, um, like I got this t-shirt from the official store. It is obviously a US site, um, so that's where they're based. Um, so I, I do sometimes go on their US site, um, and, um, they, they have like buy one get one free offers now and again um or the residents of evil they have a code roe um if you use their code um you can get i think up to 20 30 percent off at, at particular times um so yeah you can go off the proper website uh, when and it's, it makes it worth it when they have offers on and um i don't think there's any on amazon to be honest uh, but there are some sellers on ebay there's some uk uh, stock uh, people on there um, so definitely check out on eBay. That's mainly where I get them from. Unless there's particular flavours or merch I want hold of, then I'll go to their actual um, site. 
So it's, it's not that difficult to get hold of. There's lots on eBay. It's become very, very uh, much more popular on there. I, I love G Fuel, man. Honestly, I wouldn't recommend it to you guys if it was bollocks. It's proper good. Right, let's do this again. As long as I don't get proper beat up by Lisa Trev Trev, we can run in that room and then run back out. We should be fine. You can literally spend about, what? Not, e not even 10 seconds max in that room. It's awful, man. What are you saying that for, Becca? You're gonna, you're gonna Photoshop me in a, in a G Fuel yeah. advert. She just said, holes look at the camera. You're not gonna put my face on a on a carton of milk, are you? I'll be fuming if you do. <laughs> I'll be putting your face on a barbecue base if if you put me on a carton of milk. I'm only kidding, Becca. Oh, you're emailing G Fuel to me. You're emailing them for me. Yeah, what, so you need a proper, do you need like a proper mug shot? Hang on, I, I can give you a proper look in a sec. Can we just take out our Lisa Trev Trev? <laughs> so I'll end up posing and getting twatted by her. Look at that bloody claw. Boom. There you go. <laughs> Send an email to Jufil HQ for ad pay. <laughs> I appreciate you guys. <laughs> right, so I, I do need the thingy soon, don't I? Got ya. Um, so I'm gonna need the lighter soon. We'll go back for that. I don't think I can skip this. We've just gotta to, gotta to chill. My god. Yeah, we've gotta see this guy again. Did that thing back in the attic do this? Yeah man, it'd be an absolute dream to be sponsored by G Fuel. Hopefully one day, guys. Hopefully one day. Right, so we're, we're, we're on fine, but we're on like the dirty fine where we've got a ye little yellow line and not a, not a green. And then obviously I think we was on dirty caution last time. Let's get in there and leg it, see if we can get back out again. The heat is unbearable. This is a rather strange looking room. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. Yeah, we should be fine. Come on. I've, I've stripped off from the hoodie. I'm wearing a G Fuel top now. So I, I'm more breathable as well. So. Oh my god, we're on orange caution already. You're fucking kidding me. You're kidding. Oh my. You're kidding. Oh, it's locked. What? What do we need to do? Do we have to press something? Oh no. <laughs> How could we not get out? Allow it, fam. Oh no. Oh bollocks, I don't know where to step. Oh, I'm so sorry guys, I'm so sorry. Oh don't we be able to get back out? Oh no. I don't know what what like we need to do. Oh bollocks. We'll just have to leave that room, I think, for now. I don't know what to do. Oh, hang on. He said I should tread carefully, didn't didn't he? Go back and turn the boiler off. Thank you, bro. Thank you, Mac. Look at look who stopped in there. Return the Mac. Do 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 do. Here we go, man. This is the moment. Tonight is the night. We're hurt, so it's over. So we put our hands up to the feeling can't hold us. Hell yeah. 
Till the game can kill us. Here we go, man. Here's the moment. Tonight is the night. Thank you, Mac. Appreciate you, bro. Return of the Mac. So we need to be downstairs first, don't we? Need to be down here. Um, down that little alley thing. Yeah, I was thinking that, Boulder Dash. I, I was thinking, like, maybe I need to look at, like, where we're stepping. Because obviously I'm just going straight forward. I know. Uh, but yeah, I agree with Boulder Dash. It's brilliant, right? He said this is the best mod I have seen. It, it really is, um... It's got to be Aiden's like most ambitious project. This, so obviously we are on um, episode two of four. We've played a prologue, um, episode one. Currently on episode two. Oh, we can't take the boiler off. We can. Good idea though. Thank you. At least we've changed it. Um, sorry. At least we've chased it. At least we've um, checked it. That's what I meant. Uh, Dean, welcome on in, bro. I'm doing good, thank you, man. How are you? So what I'm going to go do, um, we'll go fight the boss and then, can we get to a save room before we go there? I think we can. I think we can. Um, still haven't got that guy's cowpaw. We've, we've been literally everywhere but, <laughs> everywhere but there. Yeah, thank you, man. It's, it's a decent suggestion though. It's a good thought. Um, so yeah, I, I think, um. We'll have to try and maybe save before then. We'll just have to watch where we're stepping, you know? Because I think there's literally no way out. Because obviously once that uh, heat starts, then the door locks. So, yeah, we need to be getting that right, you know? <laughs> but yeah, that, that's what makes um, th these games, they're just so fresh to play, you know? Never gets old. I freaking love vibing to the movie like Sonata. Yeah, I get you, Benny B. The the new COD, yeah, Modern Warfare Three. It's not it's not the best one um, in the series. Like I do like the more classic ones, but I still um, enjoy playing them. St it's still tradition for me to buy every COD on release, and then I'll play it like non-stop for like the first week it's out, and then I'm back to kind of normal life resumes. You know. Yes, yeah, cereal. I, I agree with you guys. Cereal hits different on a night time. That sounds good, uh, Zamph. So I'm going to go scan a mountain of Choco Shred. Is hell yeah. Guys, what is your favourite chocolate cereal? Because I, I need some new chocolate cereal. Maybe I'll have some chocolate shred. It's not had some in ages. Lisa Trev Trev, man. She vicious tonight. She on one tonight. Um, is the Crave cereal any god? Yeah, yeah. Literally, Danny's just said gotta be Crave. Yo, Desh Crave. Ain't it, Jay? Washi yada, washi yada. Fish fillet. Ball so hard. Desh Crave. Yo, Desh Crave. Alright, Lisa, you've said it once. Taking the piss. Yeah, chocolate cereal's decent, man. Oh, Rob, you've done it now. Rob's just said, what milk you having with the cereal? Oh, Rob. Jeez. <laughs> Can I sign myself out of my own chats? I think I might sign myself out. I'm kidding. <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way with you guys. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I never had any of those. Uh, Nesquik straws. Never really uh, had any of those. Right, so what we'll do, we'll use the key. But I ain't going in. Oh, hell no, we ain't falling for that ting again. Let's go make a little savey save. 
Oh, no, I'm not keen on the long life milk. Nah, you can proper taste it, can't you? Nah, I don't like... No offence, man, but whenever I taste a long life milk, I feel the opposite. I feel like I don't want a long life now I've just tasted that. <laughs> I kind of want the opposite, really. <laughs> right, I'll keep that on this quick. We're a little bit, uh, a little bit, um, damaged up. That's it. I want that there, the ammo there, the shotgun there, fully reloaded. We, we do need the lighter. Green herb. We should be good. Um... And holes are good un. You know like when you say jobs are good un, holes are good un. Hell yeah. Oh, you know, I've not had um, cinnamon cereal before. Do you remember back in the day, golden grains and cinnamon grains? <laughs> you know what, I, I didn't really used to be into cinnamon much, but um, you know what I've actually been craving? Because uh, I saw one on um, Syndicate YouTuber, otherwise known as Tom. Um, so I'm gonna say, um, he he was having uh, cinnamon swells. I was like, you know what? I could I could just have some of those. Tom is an absolute um, keeper, you know. Um, yeah, his missus, right? She'd not long given birth in the hospital, and I know obviously you, you'd do anything for your partner anyway, wouldn't you? Right? You know, if you're like a decent person and stuff. Uh, but yeah, he um, she want she wanted a Nando, so he he ordered one, picked one up. And brought Nando's to the hospital. A huge Nando's order and Krispy Kreme donuts for dessert. It's in his vlog. I was like, oh my god, that is so cool. Like, I would love that done for me. Or, like, literally, um, in reverse, I would do that for my partner, you know? That's so cool. This is a rather strange looking room. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. Okay. So, I, I don't know what to do, guys. I'll try and go this way. Oh, no, no, oh no, man, so it seemed good up until about here, we get the cranky crank and then no, we can't, oh bro, it's not fair, it ain't fair, <laughs> it's gonna have to be like trial and error this room, I, I don't know what to, I'll try to go to the other side, but. Hey, what's wrong with PSLs? Freaking love my pumpkin spice lattes. I bet they're gone as well. I, I, I hardly had any, anywhere near the amount I planned on having on the menu. I bet that's off the menu right now. Never, never had a chance to have as many as I uh, planned on having. We'll try that room again. We'll, we'll try on on the left, on our left, but ghosts right. We'll try that way. Let's go on, Mr. B. Welcome on in. No way. Have you actually got loads left over, Zam? Said I have so much PSL syrup left at work. I'll send it to you. Please send it my way. It's not. It's not skimmed, is it? Or is it unskimmed? <laughs> Did they actually get rid of sugar puffs? Thinking about, it, I've not seen them in ages. I loved sugar puffs. They were great. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. Is it semi pumpkin spiced or fully spiced? Oh no! That's very weird. I should tread very carefully. Oh, I'm, t I'm tired of seeing us dying. I want to do this. <laughs> Yes, I have uh, Dean. Um, I'll have to get one pretty soon. Yeah, I've tried the um, eggnog Starbucks last year. So good. So good, man. Yeah, you know what, Boulder Dash? At least I've tried that way. But I think, yeah, we'll we'll go like a, a little bit. A couple of squares, then we'll like turn and go the other way. You can probably like maybe go a couple of squares, then they go to the other side, a couple of squares, then the other side, maybe like in a bit of a... Um, yeah, just left and right thingy. Right, so we're gonna put this back. Hey, Jordan Roscoe, welcome on in. Said yo holster, happy Saturday. Happy Saturday evening to you too, bro. Great to see you in, Jordan. 
Yeah, the Milky Way crispy rolls, they were so good. You know what, they're probably second that I'd like, that I demand back. First, in first place are the white Maltesers. Like, why? Just, just why? They were so good. It is indeed, Mr. B, this is a cracking twist on uh, our resi. It is indeed. This is a rather strange looking room. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. You can tell I'm thinking, Hat, because literally just as we entered the room, I, I subconsciously did the thing. You know when like a dog's like looks at you and it's, it tilts its head and it's thinking? I kind of just did that and I was just looking at the screen. <laughs> right, so if we go there, go up to here. So if we stay there, then go across. Oh, bollocks. What do you want from me? I'm about to take a look on there. Jamie says don't run, walk. Like that. I bet we'll have to do a thriller. Because this is thriller, thriller night. We'll probably have to do that, actually. That is a good shout. We'll try that, Jamie. Thank you. Thank you for your guys' suggestions. I know it. You all got my back. I can't cope with these deaths. It's too sad. You have to remember to get that too. Yeah, um, well, hopefully. I'm hoping we can just step anywhere, but we might just have to do it lightly, like that. Instead of like that. I don't know. We'll try. If not, um, if not, I might just have to look it up and just see how, how we got to go about this. Cause I'm not really sure. Oh my god, Danny, I used to be, um... I used to be absolutely, uh, obsessed with Echo Biscuits. I used to... It's like a pack of six or five. I used to, um... I used to literally smash through those. Uh, yeah, we used to go shopping and uh, on a Friday. And I used to sit with loads of Echo... Them Echo Biscuit bars. And, uh, while watching Buffy the Vampire Slayer on a Friday night. So Boulder Dash said the camera changed before it happened first time. Thank you, man. We'll, we'll try it. I think. What? Oh, no. Right, so we made it there. We just got to stay that way or something. That's very weird. I'll have to have a little look. It's really bugging me. This is really bugging me. Right, okay. So, uh, Residents of Evil have uh, not long streamed this, by the way. Um, so I've just looked, and JJ and Corey, I don't know where they got this document from. They've just pulled up a file. And it's like a map, and it says where to thingy. That's cray cray. I don't think I found that. I don't know where they have found it. I don't know if I'm going to have to go go buy this map. Because um, otherwise, I don't, we got it. What's going on, Froggy? Welcome on in. No, we've only got the researcher's memo. I wonder if we go use that. I'm trying to play this legit. I'm trying to do a legit map. Let's go use this first. Go to that room. I'm just gonna go put the thingy back. I know, right? You, you guys, you know. Oh, the Mars delights were decent, you know. They were proper good. They were so nice. Um, I'm not even a big fan of uh, Mars bars either, uh, but I love the Mars delights. Man, I, I could smash a load of them right now. You guys are a freaking, uh, you guys are a bad influence. 
<laughs> I mean that in a good way, though. Yeah, man, our gaming field chats, man, they are on point. Let's see if we, we get the document from in here. So don't light this candle. Tony's arms. Falling into Tony's arms, always. What's going on, Harry? My PC, it's okay, man. It's, it's not absolute top of the range, but it's not like, it's not bad. It's pretty decent. Rocket ice lolly. I'll tell you what ice lolly I love. Right, we've not got anything towards that. A medikit. We open that. Contains various medical supplies. Oh, is that for the guy? That's for the guy, isn't it? Let's go take them to him. That's the guy's calpol in there. Thank you for the follow, man. Appreciate that. It's busy guy. The guy, the guy. Where is he? Um, he's in. So he's upstairs, isn't he? Uh, Jay, thank you for the follow. Right, let's think about where we going. Not in that room. I hate that room. <laughs> hate that room with a passion now. It's fine, we'll sort it. So go back through here. Yeah. Thank you, Jay. I'm glad you like the lives. Thank you, man. And Mike Pritch said I could watch you all day. Bro, thank you. No, I do appreciate her. Uh, Oh, you guys. Yeah, I, I used to love Zap Lollies. They were my favourite. You know, like the toffee ones, and there was all, like, different colour. It was like, like all swirls of different colours. I used to like the cider lollies as well. I found a med kit. There you go, bro. There's your yeah. cowpole. Patch yourself up. Thank you. You saved my life. I promised I'd make it worth your while. Here, take this. It'll help guide you in the trap room. <laughs> Yes! She my twerk queen and everybody hate him, we just call him fans though. Yes! Oh Fetty Wap, call me the trap queen! Let's go! A crude drawing, right. We've gotta be really, 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 really careful. I'm gonna take a picture of this. Say cheese guys, I'm gonna take a picture. Hell yeah! She my trail queen, we ain't gonna have the lockdown. Everybody hating, we just call them fans though. We still gotta be very careful though. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, Belly never even said about the trap room first. Never even told us. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save again before we go there. I'm saving it once more before we go there, okay? I'm not pissing around. Hell nah. Cheers, Rob, for sending all those diamonds over, man. Appreciate ya. Oh, yeah, the feast lollies. They, they were great. I pretty much love... Um, I pretty much love any lollies, really. It's been ages since I've been to the ice cream, man. I blame it on the cost of living crisis, still. Loved a Mr. Bubble as well. Love bubblegum um, lollies. Right, we good. So this will be the last step because obviously this is for the crank. Then we go and crank it up, go to the guard house. Let's go. Yeah, we'll just pick a mix. Imagine. Bro, those were the days. A rather strange looking room. Something's not right about it. I should tread very carefully here. Thank you, by the way. Um, I think it was Becca and Zamp. <laughs> They've like emailed G Fuel HQ. Thank you guys for infiltrating uh, the HQ. For I do appreciate y'all. Thank you for that. So we can step to the fourth one. Then we need to go that way by two. Then up one.
then there. Oh man, this is trippy. Two more. So tense. All the way across. All the way. Hell yeah. She my trap queen, yeah. We ain't gonna have the luck though. All the zombies hate him, we just call him fans though. All the way across. All the way. Two down. Oh, hell yeah. Bossed it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Finally. I can get to the guardhouse using this crank. Those were gunshots. Where was that coming from? It sounded like they came from the room next door. That researcher. Oh no. I'd better hurry. Oh no. Oh, I don't know what it's gonna be. I might go back for some. Will it let me go back for some health. Yeah, I'm gonna go back for some health. I don't know what's coming. I don't know what's coming. I want to take a, a, a green uh, herb. I, I do love Ben and Jerry's. I absolutely love it. It's too heavy for you. Jeez. I, I, I do understand, though. Um, I do get it. Oh, man. I, I've literally just realised. I do apologise, guys, uh, if you've been here for a little while. Um, I, I haven't got a, an alert for it, so I do apologise. But we've just been raided by Andy over at Bow has Declassified. Thank you, Andy, for the raid. Massively appreciate you, bro. My, uh, my very good friend, Andy. Uh, over at Biowaz. Thank you very much, man. Uh, we did actually mention, obviously, he, he has been streaming tonight. Please go and uh, visit Andy on the platform. Biohazard Declassified. Massive shout out to Andy. Um, thank you very much. And welcoming Raiders. Thank you. My name's Holster. And uh, we normally stream Resident Evil and other survival horrors. Uh, so, yeah, thank you uh, for the first time chat over from uh, one Raider, uh, BBJ Me. Thank you. What an absolute pleasure. To have you guys in welcome on in we are currently playing um, a mod by aiden watkins called um resident evil containment we're currently right probably about halfway through um and it, we're, we're on episode two um yeah we're going upstairs again it's good buddy it's, it's so good um i just love how refreshing it is um you know like it's such a, a fresh experience in classic resident evil that's the beauty of these mods so we was in here and he said it sounded like the one next door. So we'll go in with this first. We've got a little uh, got a little green herb. But yeah, what an absolute vibe getting a cheeky raid off our Andy. Absolute mad love to you, Andy. Thank you. Thank you very much, man. It said it sounded like next door, didn't it? What do you mean next door? The room next door. It's got to be this one you're on about. Hey, let's go. <laughs> Thank you, uh, my dude. That's so kind of you, Andy, man. Uh, said in and out uh, the stream. But we just want to say enjoy the mod and thanks for your kind words. Mate, not a problem. Thank you. Do appreciate you as always, my friend. I said the researcher in the next room. What are you on about, though? You on about that guy we patched up? That's not the next room. That's like ages away, bro. <laughs> Let's go have a look. Minxy Cherry, welcome on in. But yeah, guys, obviously, as you can see, this is uh, this mod is in within the uh, Resident Evil 1 setting. And um, there is an upcoming uh, fan movie, if you didn't know already, called The Keeper's Diary. And uh, Andy is heavily involved with that. He's literally, that's uh, the stream he's just done. He's just done a, like, pretty much like a, a bit of a hype stream. And... Uh, Addressing all things uh, Keeper's Diary. Now he's come back from filming that. So good. I think, is it, was he in this one? Oh, no. Someone just shot bro. Or did he shoot himself? He's dead. He could probably feel himself turning, right? God damn it. Who shot him? And why? Oh, it wasn't a deliberate shot. Huh? 
He's holding something. All the times I've always got an object of interest. Huh? He's holding something. A lockpick. Bro didn't tell us he was the master of unlocking. What are we gonna what are we gonna go unlock with this? Yeah, thank you as well, Dean, for that GG in the trap room. What a notorious room that was. And I can't believe Bro did not even give us the the, the plan, like the the layout for the trap room. You fucker. <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh man. Um where are we gonna use that? I wonder if this might just be for the maybe for future use in the guardhouse because there's not anything I can think of immediately that we need to because obviously he said we can go now we've got the crank but then he said oh I've got to do that he's holding something so I, I reckon it's probably for use in the guardhouse I reckon so we shall get gone we will kindly foxtrot Oscar no way Becca your cat is fearless I think I need your cat on this stream so it just came to me with what I thought was a toy it was a bloody massive spider did your cat take care of it did just dump it on you, uh, did it? <laughs> You've got a boy cat, haven't you, right? I forget what all, all you guys' cats are. Oh, she got the hoover up. You know, Becca, did you jinx yourself? Because you only said earlier in the stream, um, did, did you say you've got a wireless hoover or something? Or you wanted one or something? You said to, like, never get a wireless hoover. <laughs> you jinxed it, man. You've had to get the hoover out. Come on, Becca. Uh, Zanf, we will be on as long as uh, the, the mod takes us, so... It should be about... I reckon it'll probably take us maybe about the five-hour mark. I reckon. So I reckon we're, like, halfway through. So I reckon, uh, yeah, probably another two and a half hours or something. I reckon 2, 2 a.m. or something. To the guardhouse. I freaking love the guardhouse, guys. It's not a fave place in uh, Ariwa. Oh yeah, we're still here, Andy. I actually saw that you was dressed as Mr. Bradley Vickers. Mr. Andrew Vickers was out tonight, I see, in the yellow gilet. <laughs> Yeah, Andy was sporting his... Uh, he, he does a mean Brad cosplay. It was fucking ace today. Fucking his hair all slicked back and everything. The yellow gilet. He was an absolute boss, man. <laughs> oh, was it the... Uh, was it the girl cat who's, uh, who brought you the, the present, Becca? <laughs> oh, no, doggos! Hell no. Nice doggos. Nice doggos. It's a new area. There's not usually another gate there. Since when did the guard house have oh, shut us? be kidding. Yeah, this is trolling us, bro. God damn it. God damn it. Why can't anything be easy in this place? Now I need a key card to access the guard house. He sounds fuming. Maybe I can find one around here somewhere. Bro, he sounds fuming with that. Got one little cheeky space. Oh, now it's got booster camo there. That was, that's quite camouflaged in there as well. Um, I'm going to have to leave that actually. I'm going to have to just leave the, the space just to try and find this uh, key card. This is cool, man. Look at this like, new area. That is so sick. Like You never had this second gate in, in RE1. I want the doggos to come to me. I don't want to be diving into the doggos. Is it just the one doggo? Be careful where you're aiming. You ain't got, you ain't got a, a key card on your collar, have you, no? 
Yet another doggo. I ain't messing with them, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill her. Oh, there's a couple there, actually. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna do a boomstick shot on maybe one of them to try and wipe it out. That's it. Just you, do one shot with that. Bollocks. I like dirty caution as well. Nice, I'm not risking anything else. Nice. Oh, this looks cool. Huh? What's that in the distance? There's light coming from that tower. Maybe there are other survivors there. It's a long way down. <laughs> Go on, ghost. Just, just do this. A steep cliff. Maybe I could climb down it with something. With what? <laughs> so, like, some rope nearby or something. Like I said earlier, he's got to be all padded up in that suit. Oh, th this ain't fair. You can't have doggos for spawning. Don't do as dirty like that. There we go. Nice. Use the lockpick. Um, yeah, sure, surely in this uniform, the booty's got to be padded out. For sure. Surely. Nice, nice cheeky bit of rope. I like this, guys. We've got a little uh, lighthouse to go and uh, investigate. This is so sick. This is so cosy, actually. I might stay here the rest of the night. That's so sick. Come on! That save music is so calming. Thank you, Belle. Sorry, I've literally just seen you uh, drop to those roses. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. What's that shadow behind us? We went out of our way for that rope and we just got fucking pushed down anyway. You take the piss, man. I guess you could say that was a rather a cliffhanger. <laughs> so that is the end, guys, of episode two. And we will move swiftly on to episode three. Hell yeah. It'll be this one and then the final chapter, guys. Let's freaking go. Oh, what a vibe. This will load. Nice. That's so cool. That must be Ghost and his sister. We must find Tracy in the uh, in the guardhouse. I'm Tracy. Let's go. Ghost. No, don't go. Episode three from the ashes. Absolute banging mod this is. What happened? Damn. This hurts bad. I need to find help. Give up. Thank you, Jimmy, for your kind words. Said epic stream. Oh, bro, we limping. You can't do us dirty like that. We on danger. Broken handgun, and then a freaking limp shotgun, Bruh. We have been done dirty. <laughs> oh no. Those dogs. They're down here too. My weapons. 
are broken from the fall. I can't fight them off. Maybe I can sneak past them. We gotta be careful not to wake the doggos, cause this is daylight, daylight, night. Gotta do a mean moonwalk past the doggos. We'll do a mean moonwalk. We've gotta be really slow. I think I'm going to go backwards. I, I ain't risking going forwards. Oh! Shit! No! How has he still woke up? Please no. Please no. Good doggo. Good doggo. The other one was good. The other one stayed asleep. <laughs> Scary shit, man. That's right, Rob. Who let the dogs out? What's going on? Seth McDowell, thank you for stopping Please in, my dude. Help me. Oh. I think this guy's from another RE mod. He looks similar to. I don't know what his name is, but I don't know if he's from Resident Evil Revisited. I'm sure he is. He's from another mod, I think. No. He's patched us up. What, I think. what happened? How long was I out for? Where, where did that guy go? I thought Bro had patched us up. <laughs> he did an appalling job. So we've literally just, we've essentially just had a nap and that, that was it. I know, I, th I think that's, um... It's, it's disgraceful behaviour, Becca. Why is the warning over the, uh... The content in the stream only just popped up on TikTok, she asked. Well, uh, yeah, I think it's rude how we're balls deep in the stream. I was three hours in and TikTok's only just roused that my stream is absolute filth. <laughs> absolute filthy stream, Gavna. There's a note on the wall. Sorry for leaving you like this. Yeah, you fucking better be sorry, bruh. There's something very important I need to do. What more important than a dying man? I'll be at the tower. It's not far from here. Meet me there. T. I'll keep the weapons on us just in case there's a chance to um, to uh, repair them or something, I don't know. He might, he might offer to repair them. He could be a handyman. Who, who knows, you know? Bro, why are there, like, gravestones around here? Creepy vibe. It's all the gaming fuel chat. Oh, no. Is it, is it definitely still this way? Keeping well away from Doggo. It's proper sleeping peacefully. The Doggo actually looked real nice there. Oh yeah, that's what I meant. The, the, the stream, it has been filth. Like, you know, like, talking about gaming fuel? And everything? And the, all the discontinued uh, best foods? Best products? Absolute filth material. I think the internet has only just realised. <laughs> This looks cool, man. This lighthouse, how cool is that? Oh, what a vibe. I would like to get patched up, patched up though. This window is 95 so, in this lighthouse. You're alive after all. Barely. Just who are you anyway? My name's Trent. What are you? Ah, ah, damn. Oh. I can help with that. Follow me. At least Bro's gonna help us. Here, take these. They'll numb the pain. What are they? They're called Safspirin, a new wonder drug from Umbrella. Nice. Don't worry, they're safe. Trust me, you'll feel a lot better afterwards. 
So that's one of the potential um, passwords in RE3. The drug wow. name. I'm already starting to feel much better. Yeah, look at him. He's a little quiff fat and everything. So, Trent, what are you even doing here anyway? Sorry, but that's classified. I do know why you're here, though. You're here to find your sister. What the? How do you know? That's not important. All that matters is that I can help you. Why would you help me? What's in it for you? Let's just say we're not so different. Here, take this key card. It'll open up the guardhouse. Oh, nice. That's where you're headed, right? Hell yeah. Thank you. Now I just need to find some weapons. Take a look around this tower. Umbrella guards used to be stationed here. So there must be something around here. Alright. I'll see what I can find. Thank you, Trent. Bro, I'm, I'm getting the hoodie back on. I told you I'd get chilly. I'm gonna, uh... Get us back on, get all wrapped up. If we're going to the guardhouse, I'm gonna need some defense, okay? Believe it or not, this is like plus 100 armor for me. What's going on, uh, Fred? Welcome on in, bro. Appreciating ya. <laughs> yeah, I wanna, I wanna be all cozy. So I got all boiling earlier. It was because of that, um, it was the trap room effect. You know, so we kept dying and, uh, Kept feeling all boiling in the trap room. Yeah, thank you guys, thank you. The brand of this hoodie is Syndicate Original. It's after a YouTuber called Syndicate or Syndicate Project. Cod Zombies YouTuber. I've I loved him for years. I've, I've got all his uh, like track suits and stuff. <laughs> the proper proper comfy, genuinely. Soldiers orders, you have to keep watch over the forest around the Spencer estate. There have been many attempts of people trying to break into the mansion and other areas. Any trespassers caught are to be escorted to the laboratory. They'll be useful specimens. Bruh. What are you gonna do, Trent? You're just chilling, bruh. You're just chilling. What a nice little view out there. Like, I won't mind vibing. Um, I won't mind vibing in here. Have a little stream set up in here. I'd, I'd be all for that. Nice little view outside. Just there. That'd be so cool. What's going on, Timothy? Welcome on in. And yeah, Syndicate is indeed... I think he's indeed based in Manchester. Oh, you know Manny Zamf. I, I forget, like, where everyone's from, in all honesty. I, was you Leeds? Or not? I proper love Manchester. There's still so many places, like, within Manchester I want to check out. Let's go! Thank you for subscribing over on the tubes. Appreciate ya. Okay. First, I need to secure some weapons. Then, I need to head back to the guardhouse. I should be able to climb back up to it with that rope. Let's hopefully if, if the villain who pushed us over, that's if they left the rope there. Oh, I must have got you confused with someone else. Sorry, Zan. Man is ace. Proper love manner. Yeah, I, I follow, like, numerous, like, Manchester TikToks that tell you all, like, proper hidden gem locations and stuff. Yeah, Manchester's, like, it's anywhere from, like, two hours to two and a half hours from me. But it's always worth the journey. Easy. Thank you for sharing the live, Timothy. Appreciate that. Yeah, I've heard of that. I've seen that on a TikTok before, Johnny. Uh, it's a go to the laundrette cocktail bar. You walk in, it's like a laundrette with a secret door. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Did that get anyone else? <laughs> Fucking jumped down on us. Bruh. Matthew, thank you for stopping in, my mate. Uh, it said, uh, phone's next to me in bed with your stream on as usual so I can go to sleep. Well, I hope that didn't jump you out of bed too much, that, that big spitter. Um, at least got a handgun right now. Jeez, uh, that, that proper jumped on us, man. Becca, get the Hoover out. <laughs> Becca will get a Hoover out. She's absolutely fearless with that thing. Bruh. 
on rail. It's great, Seth. It's so good. Thankfully, we're still fine. Oh, man. Okay, I don't think there's anywhere to get a boomstick. I don't have to go have another look, but I really don't think there was anything else up there. What do you guys reckon? Should we just go have a, another quick look on that? I'll just try and be real quick about it. Thank you, Belle, for sending over the roses, sweet. Thank you. Shit. It's definitely not anywhere. I'm going to get this bloody poison, down. Shit. Stop. Don't you dare raise the legs. Right, I think that's it. Yeah, that's definitely it. Bro, you are gonna need a hefty newspaper to to twat that spider with. <laughs> so that's why there was a blue herb down here. <sighs> nice. Is that all that's on there? Combat knife. Is that all that's on there? Yeah, that is it. Oh, Oswald E. Spencer. We can portrait of Spencer himself. <laughs> We ain't got a boomstick. I'm a little sad we've not got a boomstick, but... <laughs> You're not like somewhere expensive on a first date, Zan. KFC all the way. literally just replenished the weapons. I ain't using ammo on you doggos. Uh oh. Oh this is cool though man. The zombies be rising. Nice. You know I'm, I'm gonna let you all chill and vibe okay. Because we go into the guardhouse. I do hope we get a boomstick in the guardhouse because I've not seen one anywhere else. I do hope so. Woo! Doggos. Why can't y'all still be sleeping? They're all, like, recharged from the nap and, like, raring to go, bruh. I love how the villain was kind enough to leave the rope. <laughs> this way? Yeah, we couldn't even thriller it, Belle. We could not even thriller that. You can't do me dirty by putting those there. I can't even... I can't even get rid of anything to get those herbs. We'll have to come back for those, potentially. Bruh. Is it this way? Oh, is it a dead end? Bollocks! I don't know where to go. I, I don't know where about to run. Hey, thank you, Seth, for subscribing over on the tubes. Appreciate that, man. I don't want to take any more damage. I don't know where to go. Bollocks. I'm absolutely baffled. I don't, I don't get where to go. It's not there. Oh, is that it? It is there. My bad. It's this another path. I'm gonna have to be careful. We don't have flight to live on edge, don't we? There we go. It was this way. Couldn't see it at all for the, the cameras. There we go. Oh. Right, let's go use that. Then we can go get them herbs. Use the key card. Yeah, I'm off back for them cheeky herbs.
thank you, Emil, for the follow. Appreciate you, man. I guess there's no going back now. What? What happened here? There are plants and vines covering everything. I know it's proper like overrun this. Gardener, when you need one. Plant Forty Two has literally been on the G fuel. It's locked. Oh, bro, there was like there was herbs out there. I wanted the I wanted the uh, the, the Spanish Valley Gold Herb. Bro, you you can't do that to us. Oh, it's done as day. We're we're literally on danger. Oh, bro. I think we need the knifey knife for this, don't we? Yeah. Everything's like webbed up. This is insane. There better be a first aid in here, man. In this uh, save room. Bruh. Yeah. Yeah, Tim. Uh, this, this takes place just before the events of Resident Evil Zero and uh, Resident Evil 1 as well. Nice. Things can get healed up. Sort out the uh, inventory. Then we'll have a cheeky save. So that's the broken. Put the blue herb down here. Um, and yeah, that, that is it. We'll, we'll keep the combat knife on us, obviously, in case we need to um, fight our way uh, through any doors and ting. Move over. I want to I stack the increments. There we go. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be a little uh, while longer, Johnny. Probably like a couple more hours, I reckon. So yeah, we'll do a little work. Tyler Argal, thank you for the follow, mate. And Bearded Dad, thanks for the, the diamond. He has a super support. Thanks so much for everyone who's turned up tonight. Sorted. So good, man. It's such a, an ace experience, this is. So damn good, just not knowing like what's next, you know. It's got a couple of herbs. Why is it being so nice to us? Thank you, Becca, for the diamond. Appreciate that. Oh god, the flamethrower! Hmm. There's a note on the wall. Don't hold the trigger down on the flamethrower when firing. Or you'll use up all the fuel. Press the trigger repeatedly instead to maximize the fuel efficiency. Also, don't reload the weapon until it's empty. Hmm. Well, that seems awfully specific. How weird. I guess I'd better take the advice, though. Absolutely, okay. So you can't get too carried away, gotta use the, the flamethrower real steady. Yeah. Warning, do not reload the flamethrower until it's empty. Got it. Got it. Cheers, Rob, for the GG's, man. Appreciate you, man. Thank you. Oh, got you. So that, those red, uh, little red uh, jerry cans are tanks. They're the fuel for the flamethrower. Gotcha. these back for now and uh, then yeah that, that'll do for now let's go oh that like semi got me there i was a bit like oh <laughs> did get any of you guys that was a little close up that wasn't it that was awful bruh Got some of you guys. Man, Aiden's been coming in, man, with a few jump scares. Yeah, I like it too, Jane. That is the thrill of Resident Evil mods. Like, I genuinely don't know what's next. Um, like I said, uh, Andy over at Bauer has declassified the Residents of Evil. Um, other ones that I watch as well, other um, Resident Evil and horror channels, they've, they've played and streamed this game. Um, and uh, what was I going to say? Um, I, I've... 
like not watch their playthroughs like I will do after. Um, obviously, I wanted to keep the experts fresh. Look at, his, look at Bro's face. He's like, huh? What is going on here? I'm like walking for it. I'm too scared. This is so cool, though, to see the guardhouse so overgrown like this. It's insane. That's hella cool. Let's see what's down here. Cool, there's some herbs. I might actually, um... I'll leave them there for now, just so they're there. I nearly took them back to the save room, but I'll, I'll have them on hand just in case we do need them. I think we'll probably go this one first. Uh oh. Are we alright as long as we. Oh shit! Oh! Bro's getting whipped! It's not like Hull to be whipped! <laughs> I ain't whipped, man. I'm a strong, independent gal. Hell nah. Let's do something to check something. I don't know the passcode yet. If we can, can we do anything with these? I think I just made contact with that. Ow! Why is it going red? Oh, actually, can you use the um? Just try use a little bit, a little bit of the. I don't think I can uh, have a lot. No, I don't think it's doing anything to it. Oh, hang on. Oh, it has as well, actually. It has. It has. If you look closely, like, they do, like, proper stop moving, I think. There we go. That's done. I actually did that one with the knife. Let's try the knife on that. Oh, shit. I did manage to get a knife shot on the other one. No, I can't quite get it. <laughs> yeah, I absolutely am. I am whipped by you guys. You guys don't have to keep me in check. So I know what kind of milk I'm using and stuff, you know. You always remind me of shit I need to do in the game that I'll inevitably forget. There we go. Probably avoid that one. Yeah. We just take out that last one and then we ain't got to worry about them then. Is that it? Yep. Yeah. Let's do this again. Tim, there's no need to apologise, my dude. I've been geeking out the whole stream at this. We all have, man. We've all been uh, really enjoying it. I'm, I'm not using any more of that. Whoa! Look at bro up there! That's it. Go on, slice it. There we go. Nice, there we go. It's just, it's just a bit difficult to make contact with the with the knifey knife on that. It's so good, man. The streams are always lit. You guys always bring uh, positive vibes across the platform. Appreciate all of you guys. Loads of people in tonight. Let's do this. Ow! <laughs> it's got to remind me that I'm whipped. Jeez. So that's locked for now. The plate, plate says 003. Got you. I'd love it, Danny. I, I'd love uh, Capcom to go back and just do a, another Resi game, like, just in this style. It'd be so sick. I could play these, like, all night. I could literally play these all night. They're so good.
And uh, yeah, that's exactly what I love about these RE mods. It's such a fresh experience, you know. Get to go back, step down memory lane, relive the nostalgia in a different sort of way, you know. Oh, this is all we got by vines and shit. Come on, surely. Yes. There's something inside the toilet. Okay, which one of you guys in the chat is going to get this item from the toilet? <laughs> Thank you, Becca. Appreciate you guys always being here throughout the stream. He's literally such a vibe, man. Such a vibe. It's just going to be so funny, like... Um, as you know, obviously, I start my work course on Monday, and from Monday to Friday, for some weeks, I will be in a Premier Inn, and uh, it'll be really funny. I will not have any of this set up. It's literally just going to be, like, my phone, like, just pointed at the TV, at what I'm, like, playing. And, like, I'll I'll but try to prop it up against something, then I'll kind of try and chill in, in shot to, like, still chill with you guys. It's going to be so weird. It's going to be so trippy. Yeah, it'll be so fun, man. <laughs> It will literally not stop us from streaming. Because at first I was really scared. I was like, oh my god, I'm going on this course and I can't, like... I thought, oh man, I, I can't, like, stream. Then I was like, hang on. Well, yeah, I can. Like, it'll just be on my phone. <laughs> I'll just be without the whole setup. But it'll be fine. So damn fun. <laughs> Researchers notes. During my time here at the guardhouse, I've been involved in experiments with the T-virus and how it reacts to plant life. Um, it's quite extraordinary how this virus is able to adapt and evolve almost all types of life forms. One of the plants grew out of control and has literally covered almost all of this place with its leaves, vines and flowers. Despite the incredible increase in its size and strength, it's still weak to fire, as expected. Some of the researchers here were caught in the plant's vines. It began to infect and transform them into monsters. I went to hide in my bathroom, but got attacked by vines and dropped my keys down the toilet. Now what am I gonna do? Well, we uh, we, we picked them up for you, bro. We can go to room three. We're we gonna go here first, or then we have to go room three first, just to use the. Um... Oh man, Josh, it's such a banger of a mod, like you said, man, it, it absolutely is. It's so good. Like, Aiden has done an incredible job, man, on this. He really has. Uh, so yeah, I'm just going to go use this. I've just left, like, the one stranded, but I can't do that, man. Get off. Bro, we, we've got to take this out. I, I can't just leave this about. There we go. Do you guys remember the the OG um, the OG um, shorts mod? Like you know, like that that had the video shorts. That was uh, called Vine, wasn't it? Insane. That was like proper thing of the past, man. I don't know if I dare go in there. I'll tell you what. Should we just go in there and see what's up? Because Plant Forty Two is usually in there. So I'll tell you. What, we'll go back out here. We'll take those herbs, and then go see what's going down. So damn good. Thank you guys for still being here. It's like uh, almost half past midnight. Yeah, let's go see what's up, because I'm going to be uh, all anxious. I know. Oh, Tim said I wouldn't yet. I feel like I'd be alright, but uh... I'll tell you, we'll go make a cheeky save. If in doubt, I think we'll save it. We'll save it, then we'll go see what's in, like, see if Plant 42 is in there or not. Because, yeah, I, I don't know which way to go first. I don't know whether to go there or go to, uh, you know, where Neptune the shark usually is? Oh, bless you, Julie. Said, should be sleeping. Uh, got work at 8 a.m. Oh, bless you. So, sorry to keep you up. I hope you have enjoyed the stream so far. But like you say, if, if you do need to take off, like you know we're always over on YouTube. Um, you can catch up with the streams uh, over on there. So yeah, totally feel free to. You know where we are. Um, but yeah, thank you. I do appreciate you being here. But I am the same. Like I, I always like need to be up like early sometimes. Like 
and I'll, I'll just chill and watch like uh, my mates, like other streamers and that. Pascal, thank you for the follow. Oh, nice. Not in until half nine. Zen, that's all right. Thank you, Julie, for your kind words. It's always a great stream. It, it literally is. It's always absolutely lit with you guys. Thank you. Always is. Oh, man, that is creepy, isn't it? Absolute scenes, guys. That That's great graphics, though. They did wicked with that head hanging down there. So good. But yeah, I'm off tomorrow. It's my last day off. I've literally had two weeks off. It feels like I've had two two minutes. Um, but yeah, we've done good. So in 14 days, I think this is like our eighth stream <laughs> in 14 days. So um, I'm absolutely buzzing to, to have got all those streams in. Like to me, that is two weeks off well spent. I've like managed to get a bit of chill time. I've been productive. Like I have like just... Sort of bits and bobs around the house and stuff. Tracy, hold on, I'll save you. Bro, she looks like a net. <laughs> it's like a net, a net bacon. So that's his sister. This is Ghost Sister Tracy. I'm glad we saved it. I ain't even got a boomstick against this thing. We'll just have to. Uh... Oh, I'm gonna have to get proper. Oh man, probably gotta get balls deep in the vines for um, to inflict some damage. Is this even hitting it? Thank you, Alex. Appreciate you. Said, been at work all day and you're a comfort streamer. Thank you. Like, lots of people say that. Like, lots of people say, like, love chilling with the stream and stuff. And I'm just like, I'm like, how can anyone... Oh, my God. Right, I'm danger. This is anything but comforting right now, this. <laughs> the situations I get as in. I don't know if we're actually getting a hit on this thing. I'm, I'm so glad we saved it, you know. Bollocks. We haven't got to get Tracy down, have we? Let me try and flame our Tracy. No, I don't think we can actually. I just wanted to try something. So I, I just wondered if she goes and does the V-Jolt for us. The problem is, man, the, these vines. Oh, it's a good job we saved that, bro. I'm going to, um, I'll tell you what, we'll go, should we go the other way first? Um, we'll go see what's going on down in the in the basement. I'm, I'm glad we saved that, though. At least we've done that. Oh, yes, Boulder Dash. You're a little ahead of us, aren't you? 11.22 a.m. over here in Australia. Bro. Freaking positive vibes all the way to Osman. It's great to have you in Boulder Dash. Thank you. Yeah, you know what? I've actually... Um, it's very rare I get a week off work. Like, I'd have to like book days off for it. I don't usually have that long, but I can't remember the last time I had two weeks off work. That's literally got to be years. And it's just like, say, um, just just accumulated a load of leave. And I was like, you know what? Oh, we can make a little Spando Valley as well. Hell yeah, let's get a little bit of, get a little bit of gold going. Keep that safe for now. I have indeed done it. Yeah, yeah, I've done a, a previous stream of that. Phobia sent in for the hotel. It's so good. Amazing uh, indie survival horror game. That was really cool. I really enjoyed that. It's quite challenging, but it was good. Yeah, it's over um, available to watch over on my YouTube. Uh, if any of you guys don't know, because we've got a lot of people in tonight. So, um, like I say, I'm Holster TV over on YouTube and TikTok. Holster TV mate over on Twitch. But yeah, all my streams are available to catch up on over on my YouTube. So totally feel free. Uh, was we over in this one? Was it this one? Where there was the ladder, I think. <laughs> Bless you, Alex. She said, I'm, I'm a Yorkshire lass in Scotland and you're legit a call to home. I'm so glad, um, you know, I can, I can bring you those home vibes. Bless you. I'm actually not Yorkshire myself, but loads of people think I am. They're like, oh, she's so Yorkshire. I'm like, no, I'm not. I'm not actually from Yorkshire. I'm, I'm from Lincolnshire, but I do travel over to uh, Yorkshire to work. I, I commute there. I do work in Yorkshire. We was only on about that, Alex, the other stream. Bread cake. Do you, do you call a bun a bread cake? I, I have this every time with my colleagues. I'm like, it, is, it ain't a cake, though. <laughs> it's only banter. Oh, it's locked, man. Yeah, it's, it's only banter when I say it. It's not a cake, though. It's a bun, right? Oh, there's a little thing under here. I didn't see it. It's locked. There's no keyhole. What? 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 
Okay, let's do the walk of shame back. <laughs> yeah, it's usually what my colleagues, um, they call a bun a bread cake. Oh, but you bake it like a cake. You know what, Alex? I, I will, I'll let you have that because I, I don't know. I don't know a thing about baking, so I will take your word for that. We still don't have the lockpick, um, Belle. We got it taken off us. I'm afraid. Have we actually got a fight? Um, plant 42 in there. I want to go back for some help and we'll have to try and uh, fight the plant, I think. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, I'm a little bit worried because I haven't got I haven't got the shotgun. <laughs> I've tried looking places, but I haven't found it. We went in there, didn't we? Was that with the creepy bathtub? Hmm. Let's go get some help. We'll go back to that plant. I'm a little baffled. Like, should I have the shotgun? Or should we get it soon? I don't know. Um... I just didn't feel like we were getting hits on that, um, on the plant. I didn't feel like we were getting hits on it with the flamethrower. Because we had to get proper up close to it, but then it grabs you with the vines. I don't have to just take it out with the, the handgun, I think. Should we give it a go, maybe? Have we been down here? We did, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is cool, man. That is cool. Cheers, Sepidor. I'll give it a go. Thank you. Tracy. He said aim up. Hold on. We'll give that I'll a go. Save you. Come on, bro. We've got to save Tracy. Let's give it a cheeky go. Oh, bollocks. Get off me. Yeah, I don't normally... Uh, don't normally fight Plant 42 with a, the flamethrower. I'm gonna have to keep this and maybe get it with the... This ain't the one, this ain't a vibe. It does say it's weak to fire though. Ow! Oh man. I know how we're meant to go about this. I know. I feel like we're not even getting a hit on this though. Trace is being no help. Irish is just there chilling. I don't feel like we're, we're doing anything with this. Come on, bro. Sorry, I think we're about to die. There we go. Hmm. Yeah, we can't get to the basement, uh, guys. I know we've got to go to the roots, but it's all it's all locked. That's the that's the problem. We've definitely not got that lockpick, have we? Yeah, nothing there, nothing there. Um... Let's go put them back for now. That's very weird. This mod, man, it's, it's had me thinking. It's not, like, overly difficult or anything, but it, it does get you thinking, though, for sure. I think Aiden definitely, from what we've played so far, I do think... Um, I do think he's definitely got, like, the balance right, you know? Uh, we can't... Obviously, we, we can't reload that flamethrower, by the way. I know someone has reminded us to reload, but obviously we can until it's fully empty. So, obviously, it'll probably crash the game or something by the sounds of it, um, if it's warned us to do that, like, not to do that, you know? Right, so there's definitely nothing here. Bro's just vibing. <laughs> nice, lad. On the fourth brew in two hours, going to be bouncing. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm still on the first G fuel. I'm literally right near the bottom, though. Let's 
So I'll probably have a little G fuel refuel it a bit. Don't know the passcode for the V jolt room. Is there some passcode somewhere? We've been in there, haven't we? No result. Oh, uh, Bell, thank you for being in tonight. Said banging stream holes. Thank you very much. We appreciate you being here, Bell. And thanks so much for dropping all those, uh, dropping all those uh, dams and roads. We do appreciate you. And uh, yeah, take care of yourself. And probably the next time you see me stream, we'll probably be in the Premier Inn. <laughs> um, yeah, it's going to be one of those uh, improvisation sort of. Uh, sort of stream uh, but yeah have an awesome rest of your weekend bell thank you for being here and uh take care and catch you very soon <laughs> what a name coming in with a follow thanks dog muck <laughs> thanks the follow that's it cheeky premier let's go <laughs> it's gonna be an absolute vibe man what a vibe right we're gonna have to go check this again there's gotta be something guys there's gotta be something Allow it, fam. Basement. Some kind of basement key or something. This is so weird. Must be something. Must be some ting. Danny Damage, thank you for the follow, mate. But yeah, I didn't even talk to you guys. Um, the games that we're going to play when we're in the Premier Inn. So obviously, I'm, I'm fairly limited. Can't do any Resident Evil mods, anything like this. Hence why it's awesome to play it tonight. Obviously, while I'm still here with my setup. So I thought, you know what? It'll be great to. Um, be able to still stream this so i've right i've definitely checked everything the desk is locked so surely in there like a, a lock pick or something definitely can't see anything else to like pick up um so yeah the, the games that we're going to be streaming um i'm going to bring my um xbox with me and i've got a lot of um games on there uh, it will mainly be obviously the the um resident evils um like the re remakes um you know, I've got games like, um, I've got like Back for Blood, um, I've got, which one called, is it, is it called Alice in Wonderland, I think? There's like an, a, or is it just called Alice? There is, there is like a Alice in Wonderland kind of horror vibey game. Um, I've got that installed, that's on 360, but yeah, I've got that on the Series X, um. I've got that. I've got got a few games. Got like Blair Witch Project. We've not yet started. Um, got a few things on the go. Got a few things. Um, so obviously we've got the Resident Evil remakes. We've got some other horror games on there. Um, and then I'll bring uh, my my PS One as well. Um, so yeah, I'll bring some. I'll bring obviously the classic Resident Evils. Um, I'll bring like some other classic games. Um, we can have some other chill ones. You know. Is there something hidden? There's nothing around. Nothing that I seem to be missing. Very weird. <laughs> yes, Blair Witch Decent, Danny. Yeah, I've got I've got um, Zombie Re Revenge for the Dreamcast. I just need like uh, the right cable to be able to stream from the Dreamcast. Would love to uh, stream that with you guys though. It's, it's like a bit of an arcade kind of vibe. There's definitely nothing there. Should we have one more cheeky go and then if if not I might have to look up what, what on earth we're doing. Tracy! Because it it Hold did say on. you've got a I'll save you. I can't even free hair up. I was hoping to obviously She looks like a scientist as well. Let me see if I can do that again. Cause it makes sense if we can what is that? 
Is that something there? No, I definitely can't, like, free Tracy. I don't think so. I keep thinking I'm talking about my neighbour. My neighbour's called Tracy. I remember when, um, it was a bit ago. I think we was, I was playing, like, the OG RE one. Um, Tracy and Ian next door. They was having a little soiree. They're, like, all tipsy with it, with the little, uh, the little Bucks Fizz and, and Schweppes and all that next door. All that bollocks, you know. Um... The kind of stuff you get at the reception of a wedding or whatever, I don't know. Oh, bollocks. I think that's it. Anyway, um, I, I even called it the start of the stream as well. I was like, I, I give it till we get the armor key and then that'll be that'll be shutting down. And the fuck me there was as well. <laughs> Didn't even last until we'd gone through like the whole Spencer Mansion. <laughs> I'm going to have to have a cheeky look. I, th I think I might have to consult the goats, the, uh, the residents of evil who streamed it last night. Might have to consult uh, JJ and Corey Z Goats on how they, they did that. Um, let's have a little look. How have they managed that? Oh, actually, I'll tell you what. I think they've... Um... Oh, no, they actually did it. I think they actually did it with the... So they ran round here. Yeah, I think they actually, uh... So by the looks of it, you've just got to keep spamming it. Yeah. Where'd they get all that help from? Oh, man. Yeah, you've just got to keep running and spamming it with the, the flamethrower. You do need to keep doing that. Wow. Corey just beat it on there. GG to Corey. Hell yeah. What's that, Jordan? Thank you, man. So, hey, Hoss, just tagged your name in... The quote for the tweet. Oh, nice. That's so cool. Thank you for that, Jordan. Do appreciate you. Um, is that a new upcoming indie horror game? Uh, Labyrinth of the Demon King. Thank you for that. I'll take a look at um, that after stream. Thank you very much. Always appreciate our recommendations. Thank you, guys. Thank you for the encouragement. We will get there. Right, little Spando Valley. Uh, we'll take that, and then we're gonna have to. We'll put them away. We're gonna have to just take like everything with us. So bring that. Bring all them. Danny, thank you for subscribing. Thank you so much. We're literally almost at our subscription goal um, over on uh, TikTok. Thank you guys for your generosity for subscribing. Feel free, man. Spam the emojis that you've just unlocked. You have got some custom emojis, my friend. Thank you very much uh, for that, Danny. Do appreciate you. There you go. Be rude not to. we got to do it. You're legends, man. We like one away, then we've got ten subs over on um, Tiki Top. Thank you. Right, so what Corey did, he just basically, they've got like every bit of help. They've got the flame for it, and then they've got. Um, where did they get that, actually? They got, like, another tank with them. Where did he get that from? I was thinking if they unlocked something I haven't. Oh, there we go. There's only half the fuel left. We'll just take it all. We might as well. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I'm just thinking of some classic, like, PS1 game stuff we can uh, stream from at the Premier Inn. Uh, I'll be bringing my... I don't know if you've, you guys have seen one. Um, two seconds. Let me just go get it to show you. I think it's just in, in the gaming room. I don't know if I've moved it anywhere else. Two seconds. Okay, so I'll be bringing my Xbox, right? And then for retro games, this is a really cool, uh, like PS1 carry case just there. 
and it's for um, the really slim, the, re the really like small PS1. It's so sick, man. It's a great bit of kit. I've had this a good few years, this. So it just opens up, it like a, it's like a screen. So I might like prop it up um, against something and then, um, yeah, basically record off that screen. I think that's basically how we, we might get around it. Um, so that's probably how I'm going to be streaming the PS1 games. So sick. Such a great little device, this guy's. Proper god. So yeah, definitely pick one up if, um, you know, you travel out and about and stuff. Um, I always like bringing it with me, like, anywhere um, anywhere I go. Like, so it, I, feel, I always feel comforted knowing that I've got access to, like, the classic Resident Evils. <laughs> so, yeah, definitely. He is literally waving at you guys, Tito. He's like, come on, I want to kick this Plant 42's ass. Yeah, thank you for the recommendations. And we, we'll have to do some classic Tomb Raider. Um, I've got a little, like, a you know, little disc uh, wallet, so I'm going to stick a load of discs in it and stuff. Thank Please. you, Gemma. Do appreciate it. Hold on. I'll save you. Yeah, that is a wicked shout, Adam. Just got the backbone for my iPhone, so I can stream PS5 from anywhere. That's so sick. That's so good, man. I bet you're having fun with that. I've actually been wanting to um, upgrade my iPhone. Well, um, yeah. So I want to get a better phone. I've, I've literally paid off mine and everything. It's all done and, and stuff. God, this is, like, terrible. This is awful, man. It's so brutal. Um, hang on. Come on. Oh, we got the sweet spot on Plant 42. Let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, he's doing so well there as well. Nice. I think it shrunk a little bit, you know. Oh, yeah. Right, now we can uh, refuel it. That's good, man. We did good. Go, 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 go. Yes! We did it! Something about just getting the sweet spot. I'm plant 42, baby. Let's go. Is it done? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> it ain't. It ain't done. Ooh. Go, 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 go. Keep grinding. Keep grinding. Yes, let's go. Put your back in there. Just a little more. Let's get you down, Trace. Come on. <sighs> Fucking take out the plant. And she's the one who gets to nap. It's bullshit. I'm signing out. Come on, Tracy. <laughs> Snap out of it. Bruh, as if. Please wake up. There must be something around here that could help her. Huh? She's holding something. They're all holding something note. when they're passed out. One, two, four, five. V job room. Hmm. Is it some kind of code? Oh hell yeah, we'll have a little cheeky save. One, two, four, five. So we'll do that. We'll put the mixed herbs down here. I'll have to take the handgun as well, I'm not sure. Leave that. That'll be fine. I think we'll roll with that. Uh, we'll make a cheek save as well after that. After that hard graft. That was an absolute graft and a half, that was. Ooh, thank you, Sean, for sending over the rose, buddy. Appreciate that. It is an absolute vibe, Jerry. It's so good in it, right? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say... There is like a, a device in there, an official PS5 version with a built-in screen. I, I thought I've, I've seen the one with a built-in screen. Insane, man. What a bit of tech. Bro. Bro, who said you could come alive? Oh man, stuck in the guardhouse. Took us ages to defeat Plant 42. In fact, me, one of the guys has only just come alive. Part life. <laughs> guardhouse. Fuck me, has only decided to come alive. Part life. You know what? I think we're gonna have to, um. Hmm. <laughs> we're gonna have to take some fuel with us. I'm not messing around. Hmm. Oh, 
always. Always. Positive vibes only. Whoa! Bro, I said positive vibes only. Does that mean you can take a chunk? I didn't want to smooch. Oh, daily caution as well! We said good vibes only! <laughs> Bruh! <laughs> they have got like proper pesto vibes, aren't they? Massive bowl of pesto. There's only 10 in that. I took the wrong fuel, did I? Oh, bollocks. Oh! You know what I've done? I've kept my finger down on the trigger. And it's like, used everything. I think so I've not tapped the, the, uh, the button. Oh, I think I took the wrong one. Let's use that. That'll be fine. It'll be fine. I just want to be careful. Because it'll use a lot of fuel. So take that. Um, take her. Right, we'll just have to watch ourselves. <laughs> I'm glad I can always put smiles on your guys' faces. That's why I stream. It's an absolute pleasure to stream with you guys. These guys are minging. Bro, oh, I'm literally just firing them! Jeez. Dirty caution again. I ain't turning back round. We'll see how we go. Um, oh, bollocks. Hang on. Right, through here. One, two, four, five. Code. I wonder what's going to be in here, because obviously we don't even have to craft the the V-Jolt, do we? Because we, we defeated Plant 42. For our Tracy. Let's have the last bit of G fuel. We still got to craft it. Plant 42's toxin renders its victim unconscious. Oh, it's for Tracy, and it? Of course it is. Selfish bish. This can be cured by mixing the correct chemicals for a vaccine. Oh, I don't know if I've, I don't know if I've even got enough space for this. Yeah, we've got that. Right, one plus two is three. So water is one. We might be able to do it <laughs> with this limited space, maybe. Maybe. Empty bottle. Aiden, what's going on, bro? The guy behind the mod, he is here. Bro, he is here in the YouTube chat. Massive shout out to Aiden. Let's go. Said, yo, whole senior message. Sorry I didn't reply, I was out gigging. Bro, I hope you've had an awesome gig. Mate, we are loving, we are absolutely loving um, containment. We're um, obviously on episode three. Um, so yeah, we're, we're going the, the full uh, the full episodes tonight. Um, said, I'm home now and lurking. Hope you're enjoying the mod. Yeah, we're absolutely loving it, Aiden. Thank you very much uh, for bringing this to the, the Resident Evil community. We massively appreciate you, man. Uh, thank you very much. Well, yeah, it's great. So good. I actually didn't expect to um, have to do the V-Jolt because uh, we'd defeat the plant. Uh, but obviously it's for, um, well, uh, it's not even the V-Jolt, is it? It's for the toxins. It's for our Tracy. So, yeah, it's crazy. Uh, I think I'm actually going to need some more. Um, three plus four is seven. I, I think we're going to need some more um, inventory space. So just bear with me. I'm going to have to heal up as well because I feel awful on dirty caution. <laughs> They are indeed my most said words, uh, Xanth. How I'm not a fair is beyond me. <laughs> but yeah, Aiden, I was just saying, I think the, the difficulty is very balanced. It's, it's really cool. Yeah, Plant 42 was a, um, it was a bit of a grind, for sure. It's just kind of getting the sweet spot on, on where to like, inflict the damage, you know. That jump scare got us as well. The guy just hanging off the, st the ceiling. <laughs> just there, chilling. <laughs> No, it's great, man. You've done a wicked job. I'm very thankful that uh, we get to stream this. So good, man. 
bro, we've, we've got nothing else to take apart from. We have got a gold hair, but we'll we'll have to use that sparingly. Um, we'll just go and finish the uh, the little thing. We'll go finish the the little bit of cowpole. This is how cowpole's made. Yeah, man, so glad um, I've been able to um, stream this. I've been mega excited to jump into this. So obviously three, and then we need three plus four, don't we? I think three plus four is seven. I'm going to keep checking it with the, the writing on the wall. Yeah, three plus four is seven. Then what do we need? Seven. Oh, two plus four is six. Yeah, got it. Um, so you need another one of four. Yeah, it, it did indeed, Aiden. Um, the um. The the guy chilling from the ceiling that got us, and uh, the the spider got us as well. Yeah, that's, it definitely got me anyway. It did get sort of a few people in the stream. <laughs> Need another container, got it. Yeah, the spider got us when that jumped down, definitely. <laughs> in the lighthouse. Very well placed, man. Proper good. Well, well. Oh, thank you very much, Kingzilla, with the $2 uh, super chat. Thank you very much over on the tubes. Thank you, Kingzilla. As always... Thank you very much, man. I'm just going to double check that. So we need six, don't we? Two plus four is six, and then combine that with a seven. Yeah. So that's 13, and then I think we just need... Um, is it just water and the red one for 16? Cool. So we just need to make three. So council pop and UMB number two. We had the little uh, V-Jolt goats we are, guys. I love a good V-Jolt puzzle. Loads of people don't like it, but I, I don't mind it. I think it's a wicked. There we go. Got the vaccine for Tracy. Things you do for your siblings, man. What a vibe though, man. What a vibe. When you get the vaccine, check the item model for fun. Oh, I didn't manage to, I'm afraid, man. I've literally just seen that. Sorry. All right. Here goes nothing. Tracy. She's absolute bright as rain. I will take a look on another playthrough, okay. Aiden, on, on the vaccine. I'm here to rescue you. But how? Why? It's not safe here. We need to get out. I know. I've been through hell to find you. But all that matters is that you're safe. Is there another way out of here? The entrance to this place is blocked off. There's an old mine shaft in the basement. We can get back to the mansion that way. But it hasn't been used in years. Hmm. It's our only option. Martinez, I have to ask you something. Save it for later. We need to get to safety first. The way you're looking at her. Here's the key to access the basement. Yes! Cheeky basement key! Let's go! There's an armory full of weapons down there. Good. We'll need to stock up on ammo and supplies. Then we can finally get the hell out of here.
It is so sick, right? Yeah, Ada, you, your mod, um, it's been very highly praised by play people across the platforms. We have multiple platforms streaming. Uh, I know, obviously, you're in the YouTube chat, but we have also been live over on um, Twitch and TikTok. And it's been very highly complimented uh, by people throughout the night. So, absolute GG to you, man. Absolute big up, Aiden. I'll take that. I'll, I'll probably take the uh, I'll take the mixed herbs with us. That's literally all we've got left. Uh, we'll do a little uh, little save as well. Thank you, Adam. Appreciate your kind words, man. So love the streams. Never disappoint. Thank you, bro. What's going on, Johnny? So if you literally Google um, like Resident Evil Containment, it will bring up um, like the website where Aiden has these uh, uploaded. And then, uh, like I say, you, obviously they are for PC, but you don't need like any sort of special program, anything like that. They are standalone mods, so you can literally just download them. You just get them in the folder and then open them and play. So easy. I'm so thankful like he, he does it this way as well. So it's, it's just not like, it's not complicated for people, you know. Oh, I forgot the, um, I was going to take the, the herbs with us. I totally forgot. It's just in case. I mean, I don't know if the, it's going to end. I don't know if the episode's probably going to cut off before we get to the mansion, but I don't know if there's something awaiting. I should rather go with the herbs. Yeah, definitely do, Adam. Dig the PC out. It makes me wonder as well, whenever I, I watch people play, you know, Resi or new mods or, you know, anything I've not heard of and stuff like that, any new indie horror games, etc. Just anything. Um, yeah, it always gives me the itch to play it, you know. It's something I'm into. You just want to literally rip out the console, don't you? And be like, yeah, let's get on this. Yeah, I'm the same. Yeah, it's good, man. Uh, but once we've done this episode, I'm just going to quickly um, go to the bathroom. I'll make a, a G Fuel refuel. Make another little G fuel. Um, for, yeah, like the final stretch of the stream. Yeah, it always blows my mind. It's, in, it's insane that the, the door sequences, you know, the, when they're opening, the, the ladder sequences, stairs, etc. They were all literally to disguise loading screens, but they've literally, they've, they've kept them, you know? It's insane how they've kept them uh, in um, Resident Evil. Because it, it literally uh, kept the suspense, right? Insane. Not yet played uh, Silent Hill Homecoming or Downpour, Danny, but they are um, on the cards for sure. Uh, we've completed um, Silent Hill 1, 2 and 3. Most recently 3. We're going to go on to Silent Hill 4. And then uh, we'll see what, what's in the order after that. I've got like Shattered Memories, Homecoming, Downpour, uh, Origins. Um, so yeah, we'll see what, what order uh, they'll be going in. And we uh, will do that. door has been sealed shut. Yeah, we're definitely going to go for all the Silent Hill games, for sure. Oh yeah, a little uh, armoury, let's go. Control panel for the power. Press that button there. Pop next door to that armoury. supplies here to equip a small army let's take what we can carry and get out of here i never actually used a gun before well tonight is the night tracy no, there's no better time to learn than now you get stuck in gal uh, no kidding let's hurry come on tracy get stuff in that ammunition everything stuff everything in the bootie eh? everything we can take the boomstick i was so worried bro i was so worried about the boomstick you know what um oh probably hang on i'm gonna have to pop back i think and put the um i might put the flamethrower back because there is a boomstick and then ammo so um i'm gonna have to sacrifice something i should have thought of that really knowing that we're gonna go to an armory my bad 
Just bear with me. Be quick as we can, just a little bit of backtracking. We've got to, we've got to grab these. The music is so sick, man. I'm so glad I've not missed the shotgun. I, I thought I'd missed it because it's just not turned up yet. It's fine, just had to keep the faith. And lo and behold, there it was. Yeah, probably, um, I don't know, I don't know where to put the handgun away. It's just in, just in case we come across, like, the plant enemies, I don't know. I'll keep the flame throwing you now, I'll put the handgun in that away. Uh, Breland at Barnes, thank you for the follow, appreciate ya. Right, so we'll take, take this. Obviously we can't, we can't combine them because you have to only use that when it's fully empty so we're going to have to keep both those. Um, then yeah, we'll, we'll take the health with us because I, I literally don't know what's going on. Um, so then we can take the, uh, the boomstick and the shells. That's been good man, what, what a grind. It's been so good tonight. Yeah, still got one more episode after this, guys. If the episodes have taken us like maybe about an hour-ish, some of them just just a little longer. My bad, other door. It's been wicked, man. Yeah, the Resi Mods, man, they're such a vibe. Like phenomenal work and effort that goes into these. Unreal. Massively appreciate by myself and I'm sure all of you guys who've been enjoying the stream and um, yeah, all, all the Resident Evil community for sure. Let's go uh, get our boomstick and shells. Nice. I love how it's the, the custom shotgun as well. Uh, the uh, the image from uh, Ojari too. So sick. What a vibe. Alright. I think that is it. I can't see anything else in here. There's usually, because I always miss it, don't I? There's usually a key like here. Nothing there. Um, so yeah, I think we've just got to um, head out now. Back to the mansion. Yeah, Julie said, I don't play, but love watching you stream then. Thank you, Julie. And, and like I said, I know um, there's quite a few of you guys who, uh, there's some people who don't really want to play them, or they're too scared to play them, or don't have the means. And yeah, like I say, I've got you guys if you don't fancy playing them yourself. It's great to have the platform, you know, and set up and everything to, to be able to bring these mods to you guys who don't have access to them, you know. But yeah, very easily uh, found online if you do have a PC. Like I say, just, uh, just Google Resident Evil Containment and this will come up on Aiden's site. Nice and easy to just get downloaded and get ready to uh, to run. Now, just because I don't know what's... Um, the door downstairs are unlocked. I was thinking... Uh, I don't know if it's the, the door this way. I'll just go check it. Yeah, imagine Kingzilla. Oh, you did say you need to go back. Okay, I'm just going to make a save, man, you know. Just while we're up this way. I don't know what's uh, going on. So I, I don't know if something's going to come up. I think I've got like, two left. Great, another one. Thank you for the heads up, man. But yeah, that, that'd be sick, Kingzilla. I said, imagine this in the Ari engine. <laughs> imagine. 
margin, bro. Insane. But yes, yeah, still, wouldn't have it any other way. I absolutely, like say, my favourites, um, my favourite RE games, like, they are the classic trilogy, RE 1, 2 and 3, the OGs. So, yeah, my, my favourite mods are definitely um, the ones that are old school RE's. Yeah, I'm a little scared about what waste because it. There's definitely yeah. Uh, we've gone to the armory for a reason, man. We've been uh, we've been kidded up for a reason. Damn it! The entrance to the mine is locked. If I remember correctly, it can be opened electronically. If we reroute the power, we can unlock the door. I think there was a power panel back in the control room. Wait here. I'll go and reroute the power. Uh oh. Tracy, come with us. You said you wanted to fire a gun. So you've never fired a gun before. <laughs> come on, he, Tracy's got a chip in, man. We, we've done everything. We fought Plant 42 and she got to nap afterwards. <laughs> and what is going to await us? There we go. A control panel for the power can be rerouted from the guardhouse to the Spencer Mansion. Hell yeah, let there be light. <laughs> So when we get back to the mansion, it is going to be officially lit. It's going to be lit like this stream. Uh-oh. Neptune's going cray-cray. Is it Neptune? Oh, of course it can be. Oh, yeah, it will be. The tank will spill out as well, won't it? Oh, Neptune's gonna be out and about. Is it? It is, it is ne Neptune! Neptune, I've made this boomstick! He, he proper turned around the other way. Oh no! Is that the baby one? Whoa, there's loads! Holy shit! Bro, there's loads! Oh no, oh no. Let's check the health. See if we can just get out. I don't know if we need to defeat them or not. We'll try to get out. Oh, we can, we can. Man, they, they were trying to chop it our little feetses. Oh, I am blessed we got out of there. We did some warning shots. We managed to get out of there. Bruh. <laughs> I'd have been fuming because I'd have—I've no doubt been wearing uh, my Adidas Yeezys. I'd have been fuming that I bit my Yeezys to shreds. Little hole would have been fuming. <laughs> oh man, we in the mines. Okay. Um. I want to get some fuel or not? We we do have a, a, a full canister there. Obviously, we know we can come back if we need some more. So we'll just remember the the little jerry cans are there for the fuel. What the? It's locked. <laughs> what was that? What is that? That's like another form I'll of a hunter. Cover me. Oh, Tracy, you better hurry up, girl. Girl, you better hurry up. It's gonna get some boomstick up its ass. Oh shit. Bro, I didn't think we had hunters. Helma. Yeah. Yeah. There better not be any more. We good. We're still fine. We're still fine. Trace is going to be all night at this thing, isn't she? Oh. Almost. Got it. Oh, no. Is there another? There is as well. Welcome to the party, pal. 
Big Hall ain't standing for this. Yeah! These are funky creatures, man. Yes! You know what? I actually didn't think of that age, and I totally forgot. So yeah, th these uh, these like type of like creatures. Uh, yeah, Aiden said it's a tick, which is from the Sega Saturn port of RE1. Bro, I totally forgot about these. It's literally been years since I played the Saturn port. Uh, Luis Cordero, thank you uh, for the follow, my friend. Yeah, you know what? The Saturn port was funky. It was good, man. Come on, Tracy. It's open. Let's go. Yeah, I probably should have used the um, the flamethrower there. I got a little too fearful. <laughs> this way. This scary, man. What's going on, Nat? Thank you for stopping back in the stream. It's been absolute vibe. Thank you for coming back. We appreciate you. Oh, no. <sighs> this one's locked, too. Oh, come on, Tracy. I'm so glad uh, Aiden's took pity on us here and give us a little herb. <laughs> Absolute Cover legend. Me. I'll unlock the gate. Yes, I know the drill, Tracy. We know, girl. Look at his face. That's literally my face right now. I'm like, huh? You serious? Uh oh. I'm, I'll be waiting. You come to me. What a time, Tracy, to interrupt the combat. Looking tick booty on the screen. Whoa, it went to swipe that and all. Nice. Nicely done. It's doing all right. Don't you know I'm still standing better than I ever did. We might have to uh, maybe take that uh hey miss clown welcome on in said hey hey fist bumps fist bumps right back to you my dude thank you miss clown for stopping in tonight man this stream's been officially open. lit let's go Stay here, I think, that so we, we we can see around the corner a little bit. Let's go on that sub mash ghost. Welcome on in on Twitch. Um, no, it's not speed run at all, man. It's just a, a nice chill vibe with uh, an Ari mod containment. No, I don't speed run, man. I piss around too much. I, I talk with everyone, so I, I chill and chat, you know. Come on, let's finish this strong. Got it. Come on. Come on, don't don't tease us, Tracy. We've got quite a little, little bit of uh, ammo left. We're good. We're good. What's going on, K the Ledge? Welcome on in. Nice. Oh, was that another door close I just heard? Oh, we're on dirty course. We've got to be careful. You dare come any closer. <laughs> How are you getting on, Trace? It's open. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Trace, you fucking gabna. Freedom! Oh, don't, don't stop doing? on there. Those it's gonna, things are right behind it's us. gonna fall apart. What are you doing? If we destroy the bridge, those things can't follow us. Let's perfectly get us off the bridge I'll first. Use the explosives I found at the armory. Go! Run! I was gonna say, Trace, don't know why we're on the bridge! Bish! Man, you scared me then. Hell yeah.
Oh man, this is good, man. Final stretch is back at the mansion. Let's go. So that is the end, guys, of episode three. We'll be going on to episode four in just a sec. If you can just bear with me a sec, I'm just going to um, go to the bathroom and make a, another G Fuel, and then I'll be back with you guys. So just bear with me a few seconds, all right? Uh, and if anyone does join the stream, if you don't mind, just uh, just letting them know. I will be back. I'm not ditched, you guys. Uh, try not to miss me too much. I will not be too long, okay? See you in a sec, guys. Oh man, I've just had to climb the stairs again. It would help if I actually, I took the shaker, but just not the G fuel. That's like leaving the save room with the ink ribbon still on you. I got it, I got it. Back in a sec.
I'm back, guys. The final stretch. Thank you for your patience. Got some little sweets off for a sugar hit. Right, let's go. Episode four, the final chapter. Have a little uh, refuel. Let's go and see um, what we be facing. That was too close. That was quick thinking, using those explosives back there. Yeah, now those things can't chase us anymore. Anyway, we're finally at the end of the mine shaft. There's an elevator just ahead. It'll take us up to the Spencer Mansion. Come on, let's get going. Let's get going. That was, yeah, that's an absolute uh, shout by you, Tracy. Blowing the bridge. And yet we rerouted the power, so um, Spencer Mansion will be officially lit. So no, we're, we're not getting any fuel from there. Oh hell no! Can't get any fuel from there. Rah. Did I switch the heating off earlier? You guys bear me because I don't know if I switch to eating off. All right, let's make our way to the main entrance hall. It's not far from here. Follow me. I've got to check this thing. I did. Trust you. That's fine. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Sam. I can always trust you guys. I'm sure I did. I'm sure I mentioned it. Told you I did. Got ya. I'm sure I would have switched it off when I changed into the, um... I took the hoodie off and had the G Fuel top. <laughs> Carving of a sword. Keeper hitting us with the line. Sounds like one of the infected. Itchy tasty. It's, it's too late for them. I'll raise a G fill to that. Let's keep moving. Bro, I want to go see Itchy Tasty tonight. That's so cool. Oh, it's all clean round here. Obviously, actually, because this is um. Set just before the events of Ari Zero and Ari One. Andrew T. Oppo, thank you, my dude, for sending over those roses. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me, Zan. She said, uh, you said you aren't that well off to keep it on. That definitely sounds like something I would say. So thank you for that. <laughs> it's unbelievable, Kingzilla. An incredible project. Sure looks different, lit up. I know, but I was all in the dark yeah, earlier. It's but the same quite an extraordinary call. piece of architecture, isn't it? So, now that we're at the main hall, what's our next move? We have two options, but neither one will be safe. Excuse me. We can take the front door right out of here and make our way through the Arclay Forest. Or we can make our way back to the helipad using the underground passage below these stairs and try to signal for help. Whichever one you choose, there will be no turning back. We're low on ammo and supplies, so either way is going to be dangerous. Follow my lead. We'll escape this nightmare. One way or the other. I promise. Uh 
Oh, got ya. Aiden said the lab route is not in this release coming on the next update. You know what, Aiden? I did see, um, what was I going to say? I did see, uh, I, I think it was, I don't know if it was on your site or somewhere, or maybe on ModDB. I did see that there was some incoming, um, yeah, um, incoming, like, updates. Uh, that's cool, man. We will, um, keep our, uh, keep on standby for the lab route. So, we'll go to the, uh, go out to the RK Mountain. So, thank you, my dude. Thanks for that uh, heads up. And thank you, Jane. Jane's uh, backing us up on that as well. <laughs> you, knocked, you knocked the heating off because you were too hot in the hoodie and the boiler room. <laughs> yeah, it, I, I kind of like, I don't know if it's psychological, I felt boiling uh, going in that room as well. That room absolutely trolled us, Aiden. You know, the trap room <laughs> in uh, episode, was it two? I think episode two. <laughs> we was ages on the lab room, the, um, the trap room. I was like, I just don't get what he wants us to do, guys. And then finally, that researcher, he, he gave us that document. I was like, oh, finally. Oh, my God, guys. Sweet freedom. Insane. Incredible that we get to see these views. Different areas and everything. It reimagines. So cool. Hey, what's going on, Drew? Welcome on in, man. What the? Don't say that. What are you saying that at? There's a truck over there. We can use it to escape. Oh, let's go. Damn it. No keys. <laughs> of course. I don't suppose you know how to hotwire a truck. <laughs> Come on, Trace. Of course I don't. Come on, Trace, you dodgy bastard. <laughs> you know you do. It doesn't look like there are any supplies in it either. Come on, Trace, you Let's can fix everything else. And see where it leads. Oh, of course. Yeah, what Timothy said. But the keeper, though. <laughs> oh, bro, I want to take back for the keeper. <laughs> so follow the path. That, that's cool. A little top down view there. Shh. There's someone up ahead. So cool, man. Wait. It's a honk. I recognize that getup. It's the Umbrella Security Service uniform. Well, that explains the truck back there. Which means there are more of them around here. Well, it might not be a ducky honk, but... Umbrella. They're umbrella? Why are we hiding? They're here to help us. They're not here to help. Yeah, you don't know the aft, Tracy. Their job is... Neutralizing any survivors. Containing the, uh. The USS Hathaway I was sent here with was ordered to kill me. But he spared my life. We can't be sure that these guys will do the same. Damn. So what are we gonna do? We're out of ammo. And with more of them around, a shootout wouldn't be the smartest of ideas. Our only other option is to sneak past. What? Are you crazy? It'll be all right. Just watch for a pattern in their movement. And sneak past when they're not looking. This is insane. You've got this. Trust me. Stealth in Just resi. My lead. That is insane. So we need to go like back down here, don't we? That's insane. A little bit of stealth in Resi. I thought I'd never see the day. That's insane. Is this right? As long as you don't get his line of view. Oh, this is tense. Oh, we made it. That is that is insane, man. Oh, we've got to do it as Tracy as well now. we will take over as our Tracy. Could have there in the uh, inventory screen. She's proper glowing. 
Yeah, if only, Xanth, if only we could run and go. We got nothing. We got no supplies. It's wicked, isn't it, Timothy, right? So good. Uh, Alicio as well. Thank you for coming in with that follow. Oh, I, I hesitated. I'm just going to wait a little longer. Just bear with me. You guys know how I am with stealth. I'll proper shit myself if we get spotted. Tracy, stop putting your hand on your hip. Don't give me that sass. This is serious. See? That wasn't so bad, was it? The typewriter just chilling there outside as well. Yes, I love sir. that. Hey, wait a minute. Why don't we sneak past by using those boxes? No way. Really? We'd be stupid enough to fall for that. No. Come on, let's keep moving. Oh, I want to get in one of those boxes. I could easily curl up and get in one of those little umbrella boxes and just scurry along. They would not have a clue. They would be none the wiser. I, I definitely want to do a little cheeky save here. <laughs> it is, isn't it, Nat? Nat says Metal Gear Solid vibes. Uh, Jane said, I hope that there's a containment too or extras added onto this as it's highly addictive to watch. Honestly, it's so good playing it, like not knowing what's ahead. The difficulty is very balanced as well. It's not been like awful, like not been like impossible, uh, not been too easy. You know, we've had to think a few times. Um, <laughs> Who's that Kingzilla? Agent 47 who? <laughs> Insane. Proper like, it, it did remind me of Hitman actually. Proper Hitman vibes, these are. The umbrella boxes, they're so cool. Yeah, proper Hitman vibes. A little bit of like Splinter Cell, you know? So cool. I'll take, we'll probably go this path, I think. Ooh, okay. Which way are they facing? We'll have a look at these patterns. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. So if we go... Oh. Right, so they're moving in, like, uh, to the left, aren't they? Like, in, in an anti-clockwise direction. So if we kind of go here... Oh! Oh! Did you turn around or something? I think we just got in someone's line of fire. That is cool though. That is a, that is a cool little scene. Uh oh. <laughs> I told you guys. You guys know I can't do stealth. <laughs> oh man. Okay, it's fine. We just saved it anyway. That's fine. I'm really glad there was a little save there. But th this is the guy's name. This is the guy you want to be searching up if you would like to download the mod. Either search this or Resident Evil Containment on Google and it will come up easily. Metal Gear Evil. Metal Resident Gear Evil. <laughs> this new game. This is a, such a great new game. Right, we're going to have to take a proper look at this. I don't want to get ourselves. I've got to get Tracy across as well. Is that right? There we go. If you just get on it straight away, it should be fine. Oh, it's fine. We're good. We're good. It's so tense. I want to like, cover half my face, then I've just got one hand on the controller. <laughs> Your turn, Tracy. You're up next. Let's go, girl. You get those crocs moving. She's defo got... Actually, not crocs. I I'd say she's defo got a pair of sketches on, don't you reckon? Ghost's definitely got uh, rock ports on. This is the absolute standard. And uh, Trace has got some sketches on. Proper breathable sketches. Come on, Trace. You don't want to leave a trace behind. <laughs> I'm here all night, guys. You, you know all, all the time. I'm always here all night. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's this guy doing? Oh, oh! We got too close. My bad. My bad. Damn it! I do now. I do have to laugh at my own jokes. <laughs> I do. I, I literally laugh at myself. Bollocks! I thought we'd be okay just sneaking behind. I think we was too close. It's fine. We'll just have to study it a bit better next time. Oh holster! I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. 
Oh, you you guys are. I hate stealth. Well, like, I, I don't mind it when it goes well, but when it doesn't... <laughs> you know, I actually do really like the Hitman and the Splinter Cell games. I used to play them back in the day. Um, but I really have to be in, like, a, a kind of mood for them. Track is tucked into his rock paws. <laughs> With a TN cap. What's a TN cap? What's TN? Sorry, Johnny. I, I, I think it's late this morning. I'd probably know the abbreviation, but it's not coming to me right now. Oh, nightcap. Yeah, total nighty, of course. That is defo a vibe, man. What track is? That is the question. We're going to be like Diodora? Reebok? You know what, actually, I haven't worn any Reebok in years. I, I don't mind a bit of Reebok, you know. When I went to see... I went to see The Streets the other week. Oh, bollocks, I get too close. Oh, no. Bollocks. Maybe I didn't get uh, moving quick enough or something. Um, yeah, I went to see The Streets the other week. And um, and uh, Mike Skinner, he actually wears some all-black Reebok classics. And they're like custom ones, because uh, instead of like Reebok on them, it says The Streets. It's got his logo on. So sick. They don't retail anywhere either. They're proper, like, one of a kind. Come on, guys. Is this third time? Is this third time? Okay, we've got to do it this time. Just have to be careful not to get too close. This is unreal, though. What a vibe. I, I definitely didn't expect a, a stealth section in this. GG by Aiden for, for thinking this up. For including this. It's really cool. Tracy better step up this time with those sketches. <laughs> sketchy Tracy. <laughs> Something's a little sketchy around here. <laughs> and then it's been a rocky road for um, a ghost in his rock pots. Right, we've got to watch this next bit. We're going to have to proper chill and observe this. Sit the G if you're like a boss. Like the boss that I think I am. So he walks a little bit this way. Turns to his to the left. I tried to sneak by here. I think we wait until he goes up that little passage and we've got to walk the long way round. So he's going up there. Oh, he's going back there. Can we... Oh, I've left it too late. I've left it too late. We'll do, we'll do it in a, in a minute. Right, and he's coming back. So when he's obviously facing the other way, I think it's easier. Oh, God. Hang on. You could easily turn around at any second. I want to wait till he's like near the top right, and then we can go bottom left. Right, wait for him to do all the little bollocks here, and then... Uh, as soon as he's up the path and then on the right, we move. We move. <clears throat> I think we can get past anyway. I think it's just a tree in it. Lovely. Lovely. Oh no, we've been seen. How? Oh no! Oh man, we've got to wait till it's like closer down. Oh no, I don't know how we just got seen. Bruh. Oh man, we, I'm so glad I've had this G fuel refuel. I thought we'd be alright. Hmm. Right, let's do this. Let's do this. I'm gonna be, be here all night now. Maximum concentration. This is the most concentrated we have been all night. He has carved the way with the rock pots. It's now up to Tracy with the sketches. Over to you, Trace.
It is challenging, man. Let's have a look. I don't know how he's soulless, really. Um, let's have a look. But wait till he goes up. Should start to walk up in a sec. There we go. So he's over there. There's quite a bit of distance between us. We're good. Yeah, we've been streaming like coming up to five hours now. It's been insane. I thought it would be about five or six hour stream. It's felt like literally five minutes. That's it. If we wait till he comes back down. Whoa. Don't. Don't do us dirty like that. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Turn around. This might work. Go, 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 go. Nice. Oh, man, we've got Tracy to get past now. So tense having to do it twice. It's not even just like a, a moment of relief, man. You, you know, knowing you've got to do it all over again, it's like, oh, bro. I don't blink. <laughs> this music's so sick. No worries at all, Danny. Thank you so much for being here, man. Thanks for subscribing tonight. Massively appreciate you, man. So bedtime for me, up early tomorrow, really enjoyed the stream. I'm so glad you've had a blast and enjoyed the stream, man. Really glad. Thank you for being here, Danny. Right, so let's just go here, just take, take cover a sec. As soon as he turns around, we'll go. Nice. Oh, man, it's so fun, it's so good. Oh, typewriter. Like clear. Come on. Let's keep moving. Praise the typewriter. Damn right. <laughs> oh man, GG guys, GG. <laughs> Kingzilla said, uh, even Deus Ex is not that tense. Aiden is a genius. Oh, man, he is a genius for, for putting this in, isn't he? Putting this stealth uh, section in. What a vibe. I mean, has there ever been any, like, other kind of stop section in, in RA? So good. Right, so there's, like, a bridge over there. I wonder if there's any supplies in this building. Oh, we can't go here, I don't think. I think we're going to have to be over the bridge. Okay. It looks like maybe the rear side of a building, maybe. Thank you, Teets, for the GG. As always. It's a train. What is it doing here? It'd just be, it'd just be chilling. Can we get on here? Can't go round, can't get on, can't ex inspect it. My bad, hang on, back this way. We'll have to go across the bridge, I think. Hey, check it out. There's a river and a boathouse. There's people there, though. There's the operatives That's there. That's way out of here. Oh, bro. But it's heavily guarded. We need to cause a distraction. Oh, God. Then we can lure those guards away. Oh, God. What are you going to do, Tracy? I think I have an idea. We can use the train. That's a great idea. I'll head into the train and see what I can do. Are you crazy? There's no way I'm letting you go alone. <laughs> She's actually going to hop on the train. Who knows what's inside that thing? Trace's Transpennine Express. Choo choo, I let's go. Myself just fine. <laughs> Besides, you'll only get in my way. Yeah, real funny. Yeah, Trace, I've literally carried you tonight. Fun. Fish. Just be careful in there. I can't believe Trace is hopping on the train. Are we, are we playing as her now? Oh, man. You, Tracy, you've changed, bro, since you started wearing those sketches. You've changed. Right, so I can't get there. There must be, like, another route we can take, I think. It's, like, round here, maybe. 
Or is it there? Just have a quick look. So a little path. Nothing there. Is it over here? Yeah, I do have a, I have a model typewriter. Um, it's given to me by a, a good friend of mine, uh, Mark, over at Raccoon City Surplus. Um, oh, she can climb up onto the train. Go on, Trace. Go on, Trace. Um, but yeah, if you search on... Uh, it's got an... I think it's an Etsy store. And I, I think... I don't know if it's got a... Yeah, I think it's mainly on Etsy, but it's, it's got an Insta page as well. Oh, Ari Zero vibes on the train. Let's go. Oh, shit. This is cool, man. Have I equipped it? I haven't. There we go. It's locked. The plate says conductor. Sketchers. What an animation. Heads will roll. Bruh. This is cool, man. Nice. Insane. Let me just double check. I didn't mean to uh, leave that. I meant to like check the thing. Not in there, nothing else in the cage, that's fine. It looks so impressive, man. Wow. I'm so excited to do the other ending as well. Um, obviously, when Aiden releases it, he said this will be a future update. Um, obviously, you, we can go the basement route. That is so cool, though. Um, man, it'll be so cool doing that as well, you know? Door won't open. Okay, let's probably turn back and we'll go to that conductor room. There we go. Look at me. I'm the captain now of this Trana Trans Pennine Express. <laughs> what does this button do? Oh, photograph of Mia Watkins. No way. Is, is this Aiden's kid? Mia Watkins. I wonder, because I'm sure Aiden's got kids, right? I, I hope I'm not cor incorrect. I'm sure he has. That's insane. Baby photo has been found. That is so cute. Cute baby, dot, dot, dot. Bro, I bet it is as well. I'm, su I'm sure he's got um, kids. I'm sure he has. That's so sick. <laughs> so cute, man. What an addition. It's the absolute perks, man, when you design your own, uh, your own damn RE mod. That is so cool. Hey, what's going on, uh, DHW? Thank you for stopping it. Yeah, it is. It's Aiden's baby girl. Hell yeah. That's such a cute photo, man. That proper... is such a vibe as well in black and white. That is so cool. <laughs> I just think that was so wholesome, man. That was really cool. <laughs> oh, let's go. Look at the absolute vibes on this. The main control panel. There's a button for the train's horn. Will you press it? Let's go. Let's provide that damn distraction. <laughs> it's all leg in it. Hidden the plan. Oh yeah, they're hiding just there. Hell yeah, I see what you did there. That went better than I expected. Yeah, I'm actually surprised that it worked. The boathouse is just up ahead. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. This is so cool. Let's get our escape, guys. Oh, what's going on? What is going on? We'll make a cheeky save. Take these as well. Hmm. A few herbs on the go. 
What's gonna happen? <laughs> Insane, man. A Ada needs to just make keep making mods like twenty four seven. I could let you play play these kind of mods twenty four seven. It's so good. There's still a, a few of Aiden's mods uh, I've still not uh, yet had a chance to stream. We'll go through after and have a look. We'll have a look on the actual site. So there's only a few that I can recall. Um, obviously, we played the Hunter mod. We played the Barry mod. Played um, Marvin's mod. Yeah, we're gonna have to see which ones we need to stream. We need to get on it, man. We need to have more of these mod nights. It's been absolute vibe. This this I music's a vibe. <gasps> Hunk. I didn't think it this far. That voice. Hunk. Is. You're alive. The death cannot die. Now it's time to finish my mission. It's nothing personal. The mission objective takes priority over everything else. Exterminate all BOWs and any survivors. Thanks to you, I'm about to complete my mission. Wait, you mean... The researcher at the lab. And the other one back at the mansion. You bastard! Yeah, he took I him out. I have known better than to trust you. How could you? It's time to end this. Let's make this interesting. Knives only. Time to find out if that training paid off, rookie. What? It's like a take cover over there. It's like a Krauser style fight, right? If anything happens, <gasps> run. Don't look back. Blades only. But bruh. Just go. Marvin vibes. But just go. Are you two Marvin vibes? Alright. <gasps> Let's do this. Oh what a standoff. This Where is insane. You? Bro, this is insane. What? We are against Hulk. Look at his stance, man. Oh, man. Look at his stance. Oh, man. We need to keep it moving. Spam it, try getting first. Get get the first hit. Shit. Oh shit. Oh no! I, I, I literally was proper spamming it. Didn't manage to get on it. It's fine. It's fine. It is what it is. And yeah, can definitely believe that, Aiden. So it takes time to make so much uh, custom stuff versus recycling uh, the OG games over and over, like some mods do. Yeah, I get you. I know you, you obviously you like to keep it fresh, add your own stuff. It's, it's so sick what you do, man. <laughs> Perfect balance and stuff. So good. Right, guys, I'm gonna have to do better. I told you, I, I don't. I've, it's pushed me to the limits, right? I'm not usually very good. Um, keep it down for now. Um, I'm not usually very good at stealth or using the knifey knife either. <laughs> so yeah, this is proper, um, proper push me to the limits, bro. I think we'll be watching the uh, the cutscene again. It's been wicked, hasn't it, Dean? I'm really glad you've enjoyed it, man. It's It's been an awesome mod, for sure. Uh, glad you've enjoyed it as well, Benny. It is literally like a, a hunk tyrant. Hunk. We're gonna have to proper spam this, man. Make sure he can get us up against the, uh, the, the building. Now it's time to finish my mission. It's nothing personal. The mission objective takes priority over everything else. Exterminate all BOWs and any survivors. Thanks to you, I'm about to complete my mission. Wait, you mean... The researcher at the lab. 
and the other one back at the mansion. You bastard! You bastard! I should have known better than to trust you. How could you? It's time to end this. Let's make this interesting. Nice only. Time to find out if that training paid off, rookie. Hunk's way better with a knife than I am. Tracy, Gotta keep it moving, head. keep spamming it. If anything happens, run. He had a little bit of a, a sequence of swipes then, it just but, managed to take us out. We'll be good though. Go. A million percent, Aiden. I said, sometimes I feel this transcends right. being a mod, and it's almost Let's like a new this. game in the OG said, 100%. Bring it on. Literally like a standalone game, genuinely. It is that, like, it's not repetitive, like playing, uh, you know, one of the uh, OG trilogy. New areas, like, you, you've added loads more stuff, man. It's been insane. It's been so good. The music has been spot on, by the way. Definitely love the, the score that you've done. Yeah, I was going to try, um... Won't let us get on danger. It's literally such what I've said uh, throughout the night, um, Aiden. It's literally such a fresh experience, and everyone uh, agrees. Everyone's like, it's so cool to watch because it's like they don't know what's going to happen next, and obviously neither do I because uh, I've actually avoided other people's streams. I always watch um, people like Andy, um, the Residents of Evil. Um, I don't know if any other ones have played it, like. Um, I watch other ones like uh, Scorpion, Kendo Zone. I watch quite a few um, people who play RE mods. I don't know if uh, maybe Bought Pursuit's played it. But yeah, I've literally avoided all streams, man, to keep it fresh for uh, my first playthrough. But I can, I can now go and watch those now. We got him, let's go! I can't believe we've taken out Honk. I guess the death really can die. Ugh. It's finally over. Come on, let's get out of here. That's insane. Thank you guys to GG. This is like RE4 boat vibes as well. So sick. Even like the cutscenes, man, look at the water on this. It's so sick. I'm just getting all comfy in that boat right now. And off we go. We are out of here. Oh man, and that concludes the phenomenal RE mod containment. Man, that's absolutely epic. <gasps> no. No. That stare down though, Hunk has risen. Bro, what an ending! Aiden, you know how to end this, bro! How cool is that? Oh, that was insane, man. That was so good. Oh, guys, absolute please, a big up for Aiden Watkins, the creator of this fantastic mod of the prologue and four episodes, which you have played tonight. Uh, he is over in the YouTube chat right now. Please, if you are in there, please show him some love. Um, absolute big up to Aiden. Um, I will uh, provide a link down below in the description for this mod. Um, he is um, pretty easy to find anyway. Obviously, if you Google his name, that's called on stream, uh, Aiden Watkins, or um, literally just Google uh, Resident Evil Containment, this will come up. It is a standalone mod as well, so you literally just download the file. It's there in a folder. You just load it up and play. You don't need any kind of emulator or other program to play this. Um, obviously, it's for PC only. Um, yeah, man, that was... Th what an ending, man with Hunk and this is what is incredible um 
no Aiden, thank you for making this mod. <laughs> it's, you know, I get to do these streams thanks to people like Aiden who take the time, absolutely tons of time and effort We've finally to make managed these. to escape the nightmare at the Arclade facility. But the cost was high. Many people died that night. Eventually, we came across an old diner and garage. We took one of the cars and made our way out of Raccoon City as fast as we could. A few days later, there were news reports about an accidental explosion at the old Spencer Mansion on the Arclay Mountains. But we know the truth. Umbrella were covering their tracks, destroying any evidence of what happened at that place. Not long after that, Raccoon City fell into chaos, and the nightmare began anew. What a vibe that We're screen! We're currently in hiding, keeping our heads down and staying off the grid. This is the only way I can keep her safe from Umbrella. But how long can we keep this up for? Only time will tell. This really was outstanding. Can't big this up enough. It's got to be the best ARMY mod I've played so far. There's still other mods out there. And um, some that is obviously um, uh, from Aiden as well. Uh, but yeah, we will definitely have to go on to some of Aiden's other mods. Because I've already played a few. Um, obviously including this one. But um, yeah, I think there's a few that we can definitely um, uh, definitely stream uh, in future. So yeah, if you guys are up for that, please... Uh, Feel free to join us. But yeah, I've been multi-platform streaming, guys, so do feel free to follow me. Uh, I am Holster TV over on TikTok, YouTube, uh, Holster TV mate over on Twitch. Um, all of my previous streams are available to watch over on YouTube. So if you have missed part of the stream, you want to catch up. Um, obviously, once I, I go offline shortly, um, they will all be available to watch um, over on uh, my YouTube. Um, and over in the YouTube description, I will um, include a link. Uh, to this mod where you can find it um, otherwise like i say it's just a, a cheeky google will bring this up uh, pretty easily um and yeah there's a link to all my socials down below in the youtube description as well feel free to follow me um on any of those that's where i update you guys via my posts my stories let you know when i'm next live but i'm so glad uh, you guys have enjoyed this and absolutely again once again Aiden, absolutely big up to you man thank you very much for taking the time um to stop in and chill with us in the stream over in the youtube chat thank you very much man um so yeah thank you um, we have absolutely appreciated the mod and um, it has received heaps of praise um, in the chats across the platforms um, so yeah I'm going to go offline for now guys um, I will keep you posted when I'll next be live it m most likely might be um, maybe around midweek um, I don't think it will be like Monday night uh, but potentially maybe Tuesday, Wednesday night I will try and come on um, obviously um, as, as I've said uh, I start a work course on Monday so I will be in a hotel Monday to Friday uh, for some weeks uh, but Obviously, the weekends, I will be here, so I'll aim to do one to two streams at the weekend. Uh, but otherwise, during the week, it will be, um, like, it will literally be on my phone, and it will most likely be on TikTok, because it's, like, the easiest one to kind of stream to, uh, just from my phone, like, with the layout and stuff. Um, so, yeah, I will probably just, it will literally be just that propped up against the TV, what I'm playing, and then I'll just be chilling uh, nearby. Like, <laughs> you know, I'll just be chilling, like, within view. Um, so, yeah, that's how I'm going to be uh, basically able to stream uh during the weeknight so yeah we, obviously we just have to make make use with whatever we have there um during the week but yeah weekends will be um obviously um normal uh normal um like streams you know uh when i'm back with the setup um like i said I've, I've still got to put like a lot of time and effort into studying on this course and everything so I've, I've got to get the right balance to be able to um you know make sure i pass the course and everything but um yeah i'll make sure i can get some streams as well so thank you guys i'm just going to go offline uh, right now on tiktok um and then we'll look to uh yeah we'll look to raid out as well we'll just go and um raid out right now while we still got people in um so yeah thank you guys uh for being here uh we massively appreciate you um i think we'll go and raid who do we raid um evil cherryberry is playing resident evil 3 i think we should go raid her uh, she seems absolutely sound. We've raided her before. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. Uh, do appreciate you all. Uh, thank you, Seth, as well, and uh, BB as well. Thank you guys uh, over on Twitch. Uh, I'll jo join you very soon uh, over in the chat um, with Evil Cherryberry. Uh, we're just going to go raid her now. So thank you very much, Twitch, and I will see you in a bit. See you on the next stream, guys. So that is Twitch out.
Um, just make sure the raid goes over okay. Um, so yeah, you, we, we've got to carry over the uh, the Resident Evil vibes, you know. Um, so yeah, there we are. We are the, uh, with the the raid. But yeah, she seems to sound lost. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna close down over on TikTok and then. Um, and then uh, I will close everything down on YouTube. So, yeah, thank you very much, guys, over on TikTok. We've had uh, some new people in tonight. Thanks for all of uh, the subscriptions. We're almost at our member goal over on TikTok. Nine out of ten. Ten is the goal. Ten uh, memberships over there. Um, and like I say, then we'll, then we'll uh, extend the goal. So thank you guys for getting on board with subscriptions. Uh, thank you for all the diamonds and roses, all the donations as well. Uh, really appreciate you guys uh, for your support. But, yeah, I will um, be back uh, during the week over on TikTok. Uh, with the stream um, over from the cheeky uh, Premier in stream, it'll be um, on the go. So yeah, I I'm I'm still proper hyped for that. We will absolutely make the most of the setup that we have. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys over on TikTok, and I will uh, see you during the week. Uh, have an awesome rest of your weekend, and uh, I will see you during the week uh, for the next stream. See you in a bit, guys. Much love. I love y'all, guys. Good night, TikTok. Alrighty, I'll take us back to our just chatting screen. There we go. What a mansion! So yeah, we are still here uh, over in uh, over in the tubes. Thank you guys um, for for staying here with us um, right to the end. And uh, like I say, I'm so glad um, you guys are st still here. We've got Aiden, uh, Jane G, DHW, Dean, and ev everyone else who's still here. Thank you uh, for still being uh, still being in tonight. Um, but yeah, what what an absolutely phenomenal mod. Uh, I knew it would be good. I've heard heaps of praise about this. Um, I've, I've literally seen just the snippets of gameplay. I made sure like I didn't like properly watch through because I wanted this to be fresh for us and it's been an incredible experience. So um, yeah, we've had five hours of an absolute vibe tonight. Um, it's been an incredible stream. As always, the, the streams are always good and it's all thanks to you guys uh, bringing all the um, positivity and good vibes. So uh, yeah, I thank you all, as always, guys, for your support. Um, we've had some uh, uh, real kind super chats as well uh, in from Kingzilla tonight. Um, but yeah, thank you guys just even for, for being here. That is more than enough. Uh, so yeah, if you have enjoyed the mod, if you haven't already, if you don't mind dropping us a cheeky like, it helps us a ton over in the algorithm. And let's get Aiden's work out there. Obviously, it is already massively out there, but let's just keep pushing it. We've just got to push this far and wide, you know? Um, absolutely amazing. Uh, but yeah, good night to you as well, uh, Jane and uh, Dean as well. I will see you very soon, mate. Take care, guys, and have an awesome rest of your weekend everyone in over on the tubes and uh, yeah i will see you during the week um it will most likely be on tiktoks that's like literally the only kind of um streaming one i can get set up with on the go um so yeah just keep an eye on my socials obviously all the links down below in the description but apart from that at the weekend i will make sure i get at least one streaming and it will be normal on the setup when i'm back home because uh, like i say i'm monday to friday on the course and then weekends i will be returning home so, uh, yeah, if I don't see you during the week, guys, hopefully catch you next weekend. I will be keeping the stream momentum up as much as possible. Um, and, yeah, I'm so grateful for all you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you very much for being here. Take care of yourselves, and I will see you on the next stream. Take care, guys. Much love to you all. Good night.